Mic test, mic test. Hello everyone and welcome back to another Buddy Bison stream. I hope we're all having a wonderful day today. I hope we're all excited to continue further into Trails into Reverie. Excuse me while I just add Act 2 to the stream title. There we go. 
Uh, so last time on stream, we uh, started, or we got back to, or I mean, I guess we did everything that we said we would uh, in uh, Reverie Corridor. Um, between last stream and this one, I did actually play a little bit more because I wanted to, um, essentially I unlocked Pom Pom Party, so I wanted to do that. I wanted to also do some more um, of the, um, I wanted to do some more Vantage Masters. So I beat Claire, and then also I reset everything so Ash would be here. Um, one thing... There we go. Um, I, I forgot that, like, a lot of these have, uh, ha have bonus, like, dialogue, so I wanted to make sure I could actually, like, save this. Um, so right now Lecter and Ash are at the ma Advantage Master's table, so I guess I'll just go through this. Uh, damn, you really chilled out since we first met, huh? You know, I was serious about recruiting you into the intelligence division had you dropped out of the branch campus. Jeez, I thought Randonur and Valentine's hard cells were crappy. Who doesn't want to recruit me? Uh, I was thinking about dropping out, but it turns out I'm surrounded by too many dumbasses that'd be lost without me. Uh-huh, sure. You should be more honest with yourself for a change, but I'm happy for you. Enjoy your youth, kid. Your school days are some of the best of your life. So make some memories while you can, because you'll miss it once it's gone. Please, like I need to hear that from you. Hey, you're that Lloyd Bannings everyone's always talking about, ain't you? Well, Philly and Randolph won't shut up about you. Like, ever. <laughs> Especially how for some big national hero, you're also as famous for being a lady killer. That true? <sighs> Rumors of my philandering have been highly exaggerated, I assure you. Yeah, yeah. Shores are always puts on the modest act, too. We all know the truth about that. Must be fate that has me crossing paths with a real celebrity playboy like you. What do you say you and I sit down for a round of Vange Masters, huh? There are plenty of chances to show off how strong we are elsewhere, but not so many to see what really makes a man tick. You in? Sure, that could be fun. Certainly want a chance to get to know you better, seeing as you're Eunice's friend and one of Randy's own students. Doubt I'm quite as smooth a customer with these things as you, but hopefully I can still make for a decent match. Uh, there we go. So. Yeah, so that's the case. I also uh, found out something interesting. So if you reset the, um, if you reset the corridor, it basically makes it so you now, you can't travel to the depths. Uh, hey, sleeper. Uh, I bet that boy boy was one of the kids at the arcade that beat someone up in the alley, <laughs> in the alley for using throws. I mean, no. I've only ever been to, like, small time arcades. Like, there was an arcade at, like, my grandparents, like, retirement place. Well, I say retirement place. It was like a, um, uh, what was it? Uh, like, one of those... Play, one of those places where people can park their trailers or whatever um, and like a whole bunch of people like lived there um, like there was a small time arcade for all the grandkids that would come and visit um, like that's the only arcade I've ever been to um, and I was also quite young when I went to that arcade so I don't think I could beat anyone up in it <laughs> anyone up uh, but how are you doing today sleeper hope you're doing well but yeah so um, if you reset the Reverie Corridor makes it so you can't fast travel to the depths of the thing that you, uh, of it being reset. So I'm curious to know if, like, that's the case for the entire thing or just a stratum. Like, you can still go to the entrance of each stratum even after resetting. Um, but I did, um, did get another blue ceiling stone, some more silver shards, and more ceiling stones. So I might as well open these up right now before I go back to the real world. Um, nice. So, Clinktail, Oz, Oz, Crimson Costume, Dang, I get that Holy Chain, Chrono Drive, um, that's pretty good, Energy Drink, uh, CP plus 15, I'll take that, open that, please, I hope you're doing well, Sleeper, you playing, single player games, so gotcha, lucky. yeah, <laughs> Cross Crusade R, Chrono Drive R, okay, so I just got a Chrono Drive, Muse's Casuals, U Material, Time Set with U Material, Crest, SR, Ryan Long, School Go Ren, yo, that's good. Um, Golden Sphere, Shiny ATS, SR, nice. Uh, <laughs> you know, but it kind of goes too all over again. Yeah, except this one, it's a lot less bad because, like, like my issue with Xenoblade Chronicles 2, and it's gotcha, is that there are actual, like, things that you can miss because there are non important characters, right? In this game, Right, you have blue ceiling stones, that unlocks a certain thing and there are only so many of those things. You get a gold ceiling stone, 
that get that unlocks a character, but there are only so many characters, so you're guaranteed to unlock them all if you get all the gold ceiling stones. Um, and like the silver ones are more just for items. Um, like the gotcha in this game is a lot less annoying because if you get an item, you're guaranteed to essentially get a good one. Whereas the gotcha in Xenoblade 2, it's, pedestal in my opinion, kind of garbage because there are unique blades that have unique side quests that you just have to rely on luck to get. And then even that, you have to specifically, if you want them on a certain character, you need to get them on that character. But, like, there's, yeah, it, it in my opinion, it's a bad way. Guaranteed unlock all these units of core crystals. No, yeah, if you luck. use enough, but then it's not going to be on necessarily the person that you want them to be on, which is an issue. In my opinion, Kitty Noir, a uh, cute kitty themed beachside look for million. Okay. Fire bolt SR, strength, chrono drive R, chrono break S. Ooh, that's good. Delay plus eight. Um, speed. Okay, so chrono break SR. Let's go put that on. You can transfer blades. I'll go. You can? I thought you couldn't. I thought you had to like unsummon them and then resummon it on the one part. I thought you had to literally have all of them unlocked and then only unsummon one and then retry it again. Let's open them. Oh, Z, because he has the highest luck stat. Interesting. Um, okay, so you. Speed breaker. Action. Uh, oh, yeah, there wasn't really all that much, like, good stuff with um, AT delay, which is why I didn't really. Or uh, with delay in general, which is why I didn't really go for it. But this gives delay plus 8, which is really good. That's Chrono Break. Ooh, Chrono Break R also gives plus eight, but I presumably can't put both of them on, so that's fine. Um, yeah. Uh, drive, speed up. Uh, anything that increases Chrono Drive R, speed up four. No, that's net negative. Um, here, do, do, do Speed Breaker. I thought I saw... No. no. There it is. Okay. But yeah, so went around, swapped some stuff off. Interesting thing, Rosalia. Ooh, wait, did she come... Does she have a unique Master Quartz? Do, do each of the people that we get have unique Master Quartz? 30% chance to absorb magic attacks, offensive arts to crit, recover 1% EP through offense. That's really good. Um... Who you have evade break damage up and then Virgo that let's see you please yeah no I'm I'm gonna do it and honestly if I can I would probably like to put that on something because that has a lot of good stuff on it that's just a good that's a, that's a really good quartz that is that is really really good um yeah okay. But yeah, I'm not, I'm, and I'm going to save Stop up, um, I'm going to save up some of these blue ones for, um, I don't know, for maybe a later stream where I'll just focus purely on, activated. like, watching some of them, um, but I'll at least unlock the ones that I have now. Uh, Daydream, a day in the lives of the SSS is now available. Ah, see, that's nice. Uh, but yeah, so there's that. That I do, we can't do any trial ones. I did do the pom pom party and Vantage Masters, um, which is fun. Um, so because I did all those things, I Connecting do have some Garden, uh, missions that I completed. Um, yeah, so not sure if they're all that um, important, but yeah, so I can get a mute four. Oh my god, that, okay. I was not expecting them to go that hard, that high. Mute four, and then intimidation times one. Okay, and then uh, effort. Okay, so use 10 silver unsealing stones at the unsealing pedestal. Use five silver unsealing stones. View three daydreams. Yeah, so I could get a blue emblem if I went and got another blue one and watched it with the two others, but not going to. Um, I have 260. I don't know why you would ever spend them on these until you have unlocked these other ones first. 
Um, but yeah, I'm thinking the one that I'm going to get next will probably like I, I have to imagine that the best ones to get are max BP because that's just straight probably the best and then support slot and then AG because AG is important but it's not like the most important is how I would probably um, is how I'd probably say hey Lloyd what's up just checking in so you changed your uh, changed over your casual clothes didn't you? yep yes since this area seems to be safe for the most part I change back when it's time to head into the corridor again the current outfit doesn't seem to provoke quite as much ogling however Instructor Reen was rather flustered by your other attire when we met in the Geofront two years ago. W was he? Th that's some. Um, I. Altina, you know better than to make things up. <laughs> I almost forgot about that little run in the four of us had. Yeah, that is true. This this group did have a fun little run in. I could have imagined we'd be working together like this someday. We were crossbow's enemies at that time. But that's not the case anymore. Everyone from Erebonia feels the same way you do. It's going to take all of us working together to fix whatever's happening in the real world. No arguments for me. We'll be counting on you all. Okay, so now let's uh, mosey on out of here so we can get back to the main story. Return to Zemir and leave her and resume Reen's story. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Departure noted. Um... Oop. <laughs> Flashed Reen for a hot second. So... Huh? What were you just doing? I feel certain that something significant just happened, yet I cannot recall what. I remember us meeting with Her Highness and Representative Regnus and resuming our investigation, but... Then... We were just about to get gone, right? Right. That's the last thing I remember, too. But if that's the last thing we did, why does something feel so... Off? Why do I suddenly feel so much stronger? <laughs> why do I have items that I shouldn't have? <laughs> why do I know recipes that I shouldn't know? Maybe there's more to this mirror here than meets the eye. More than meets the eye. Are you alright, Instructor? Sorry, I'm fine. Let's get back to the investigation. Got a lot of people depending on us for this. Right. Hopefully you can at least find one useful clue. Mm -hmm. Before his investigation then began a new. Reen's route has been suspended for now. Other routes must be advanced further before his can continue. Okay. Resume investigation. Head to the Angel Battlefield. Walk through the Garnier District. Okay. Um. So. You're currently playing this route? Okay. So. <sighs> yeah, you know what I said? I said I was gonna do. I said I was gonna do C's. Let's see, let's see if time has passed, though. Is, I guess, my question. Walk around the Garnier District. Okay, time indeed has passed. Picking up the creeps will cause the main story to advance. Heimdall will become inaccessible, as well as sub-events yet to be seen. Okay, I'm going to hold off. Um, because I just want to check out. Um, okay, so you got you. Yeah, cast two. You really don't need cast two, though. Like... I should probably, like, I'll probably swap that out with something else. I mean, right now you don't really have like, all that much options, is the main thing. Alright, because these guys are still limited to uh, what they have, not what anyone else has. Uh, yeah, you got camouflage on. Okay, is there anything else? No. Right? Nothing. Nothing. Okay. Let's go. Let's advance the plot. Take crepes. Here you go. Two chocolate banana crepe specials. Enjoy. Thank you. Okay. Back to Nadia and Lapis. Two cute it's children. Beautiful. <laughs> crepe. You know, I might be kind of late in asking this, but are you all good? With what? <laughs> like, is it safe for you to be downing all this human food? Like, you're not gonna break from one too many desserts, are you? That is a very good question, right? Because it's like, you would imagine that there'd be very fine machinery in there. <laughs> so it's like, yo, like, where does this food go? And is it gonna clog up any gears or pistons or anything? I think it's fine. 
Hey, Fontana, how's it going? Not here, you're still a nerd, bye. Okay, see ya. <laughs> uh, My body seems to be converting the food I consume into fuel to keep me energized. Oh, okay, so it just works like a normal body. It's not as efficient as recharging with septium, but it's not terrible. <laughs> huh, so you're voracious by design. Wait, let me get this straight. You can pig out all you want and not gain a single curum? It just gives you energy? Oh yeah, I forgot that they had a this world specific weight system as well because they never really like weight never really comes up most of the time it's usually like oh reach or arge right it's usually distance that comes up in conversation more or it's like oh how far away are they or how fast is it going but it's like oh yeah there is a weight system in, in this game as well mm -hmm. rosenberg dolls are made to retain their shape no matter the circumstances okay Humans gain fat from eating too much food, though, don't they? Are you looking to gain some weight? <laughs> Are you looking to get fat? Uh... <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> really had to say that after I picked it up, huh? I, uh, I'll be fine. You will be fine. You move around a lot in combat. It's fine. I'm a growing girl with the metabolism of a horse. Huh? If I don't eat like crazy, I won't get that extra va va boom that's sure to get S's love on lock. <laughs> okay. <laughs> if I don't eat like crazy, I won't get the big bonk Hanukkah hoogs and the, <laughs> and the hourglass figure. See, it's interesting that she's she's saying won't get his love on lock as though she doesn't already have it. va va boom sounds nice. <laughs> good luck. <laughs> va va boom sounds... I don't know what that means, but okay, sounds good. Oh, there's the other party. Hmm. <laughs> Why don't we walk and talk? They say that's the best way to enjoy food from a stall. All right, let's go. Since we're on our way, I read there's a real nice food spot along Banker Street. Really? Banker. Then what are we waiting for? Let's... <laughs> oh. Oh, damn, look at Nadia. Are you okay? Look at Nadia setting shit up. I'm okay, thank you. Sorry about that. She can be a little clumsy. Aw, no worries. I'm just glad I could be her cushion so she wasn't hurt. Good job, William. Oh no, my crepe. Fuck. Don't be sad. You can have mine, LP. Are, are you sure? Of course I am. Anything to make you smile. Look at you, Nadia. Yay! Thank you again for catching me before I fell. No problem. Just try to watch your step from now on, okay? We can't waste that food. It just gets on all fours, just eats it off the ground. <laughs> Fallen creep. Hmm? Oh. Interesting. So it's just hard forcing us off the path? Remind me where we're going again? We're trying to find the army rebels Representative Regnus informed us about. Easier said than done. I like they'll pop out of the woodwork to announce themselves around the capital. No kidding. It's gonna take some real footwork to track them down. But for now, it won't hurt to pay a visit to the guild since it's in operation again. Might be able to find a lead there. It's worth a shot, yeah. If anybody's gonna have intel on the rebels around here, it'll be a bracer. The closest range is probably out east on Alto Street. Fee and Sarah aren't there right now, though, right? Right. Certainly it would have hastened our inquiry if we were working with two people we knew, but it is what it is. <clears throat> this is the same pain I felt before. Huh? Pain? Everything okay? Since we're on our way, I've read there's a ni real nice food spot on Vanker Street. Really? Well, let's go. Ah, oof. Okay. You okay? I'm okay, thank you. Sorry about that, she can be a little clumsy. Oh, no worries, I'm just glad I could be her cushion so she wasn't hurt. I I'm see, I'm surprised that they don't just reuse the same voice lines that they just used. No, my crepe. My crepe. Don't be sad, you can have mine, LP. Uh, are you sure? Of course I am, anything to make you smile. Yay! Okay. Thank you again for catching me before I fell. No problem, just try to watch your step from now on, okay? 
so Nadia did something there. Like, she obviously tripped LP, like Lapis, but I'm curious to know what she did other than that. Like, did she put a tracker on Milliam or something, or what? They seem rather close. They must be sisters. Well, if they are, then we got Shomu comes out on top, right, Tilly? In what way? As sisters who love each other the mostest, that's what. Incoming! Oh, damn, she went for that dodge. She ducked it. Fuck, man. Hey, why'd you dodge me? I'm not going to fall for the same trap twice in one day. So I can still hug you once a day? Good to know. That's not what I... Got a message from the Intelligence Division? Yes, it's a reply to the request I filed for materials related to the Imperial Army. Nothing at a glance strikes me as new, however. That's a bummer. Hey, wait a minute. I was on that request too, wasn't I? How come I didn't get a message? That is strange now that you mention it. Hmm, maybe I just got distracted by your Arcus going off and didn't notice. Let's see. Oh, Nadia fucking pickpocketed her. And took her Arcus. <laughs> huh? What the? What the? You're kidding me! What's the matter, Milliam? My Argus too! It's gone! <laughs> I can't find it anywhere! <sighs> Don't tell me you dropped it somewhere. Is it just me, or does that sound bad? Oh, it's bad, all right. Not only is that a custom model, it's up to your neck with all kind of top-secret info. It's got some securities, at least, so not just anyone should be able to access it, but still, not good. I'm surprised that's not chained to your person, right? Like, tied to you. Stapled. If somebody wants to hack it badly enough, then that's what they'll do. Well, let's retrace our steps. Do you think you, ha you lost it at the hotel? No way. I definitely still had it on me when we left the lobby. And you only could have lost it in the last few minutes. Hmm. It's obvious, isn't it? One well, of those kids swiped it earlier. But the, the one in purple pretended to trip and swept it as soon as Milliam got caught her. It could be. You think those little girls could coordinate something like that? You see all team Milliam? Besides, both of them are short enough that they'd be easy pickings for theft by kids that small. I don't appreciate being called out on my size, but I otherwise agree. As much as I hate to believe it, the most likely suspects here really are them. Indeed, there are no other options given the evidence at hand. Now for the real question. What reason could they possibly have for stealing it at all? Judging by their appearance, I doubt they intend to hold it for ransom. If they really did take it, there's clearly more to them than meets the eye. Now all we can do is try to find them and get it back ASAP. But, without the cap but with the capital so packed, I doubt we'll be able to just find them and follow them like that. You got any ideas, maybe? <laughs> Don't worry, I know just the thing. As it just so happens, my Arcus has a special feature for emergencies like this. Oh, right. I do recall that feature. Are you talking about? Are you talking about some kind of tracking device? Yep. Lucky for me, com combat ordnance issued agents come included with a special kind of transmitter. It's supposed to send out orbital waves every once in a while. A like the ones that they kind of use in um, just Azure for the uh, a side quest, or no, not the side quest, the main quest, right? To find the Bracer Girls. You know you know its code and frequency, and I know mine. Then you can figure out where it is, no problem. <laughs> well, ain't that nice and convenient? I know, right? There's lots of other stuff our units can do. I don't really get to use them much, but they're still really cool. Personally, I think it would be more of a shock if vital equipment for agents didn't have such precautions built in. Guess we got our solution then, huh? No need to worry about searching all the crowds. That's right. Now what are we waiting for? Let's get little buddy back. You think I can borrow yours until we find mine, Tilly? I don't see why not. Go ahead. Okay, turning on tracking mode, narrowing down its location, and found it. The signal's coming from Vancure Street. Okay, and uh, Vancure Street ran the other split into two groups to look for the paragraphs. And so, so, so that was C's plan, right? It was hey, we're gonna, like, there are too many soldiers. We need to get someone else to kind of deal with them. Natty is setting it up, so it's like, hey, they have to come get this. <laughs> we can just use this to lead them. That's really smart. However, how'd it go? We searched all the stores on the eastern side, but to no avail. Same on the west. We even took turns watching people come and go outside, but nothing. 
Do we perhaps ask around? It's possible they might have already moved to another district. Uh, might not be worth the time it'd take in that case. Agreed. Location signal should be updated momentarily anyway. Yep, right about... Now! They're in Draco's Plaza. Great, let's hurry after them. Draco's Plaza shouldn't be a difficult place to search. It's literally a flat plaza. Not here either. Hold on, the location data should update in a sec. Okay, now they're on Alto Street. Feels like we're just playing a game of cat and mouse here. Yeah, we should get update more often. This works well enough for when the target is standing still. But it isn't likely going to be enough when they're so active. Bah, this is hopeless. Do we split up and try to cover as much districts as possible then? Capital's too big for that, I think. We spare ourselves too thin. And I've spent more time walking around the capital today than I've ever wanted. First it was the Garnier District, then it was Vancure Street, and now Draco's Plaza. It feels that we've walked exactly this route just this morning. Now you mention it. You're right! Use is your genius! I don't disagree, but what of it? Look at this! That's quite a neatly bound magazine. It's the food issue of the super popular At Home and Heimdall series. Yeah, but why are you bringing it up? Because it's a guidebook to all the best spots to eat in the city. It even lists rare seasonal foods. Anybody who loves good food isn't going to walk around here without this. Could you please get to the point? I'm getting there! So far, they've gone from the Garnier District, to Van Cure Street, to Draco's Plaza, to Alto Street. And when bu we bumped into them, they were eating the same crepes I got from the Garnier District. Which means, drum roll please, they're following the guidebook's top snacks on tour route! I know, because I started following the same one. I hate how plausible this actually sounds. Can we really afford to stake our success on such a silly sounding idea? Yes, we can! <laughs> it might sound silly, but it's better than anything else we've got. So how about we try using that magazine to get one step ahead of them? really here. <laughs> I knew it. I knew my gut was telling me something good, but they're by the path that goes down into the sewers, which is where they need to be, like the the uh, mezzanine like sliding path from CS1, no less. And CS3. That just happened to be hungry at the same time you bumped into them. Yes. Shall we strike immediately? No, duh. I'm not gonna make them pay for stealing my arcs, too. Don't do anything yet. Let's listen on them for a bit. I want to know just who they are. Ah, uh, well, if you say so. <laughs> Let's listen in from this distance away, because surely they're talking at a volume that can be overheard. Can't believe we did the whole tour in half a day. Is it really so amazing? It's crazy. Just not as crazy as your crazy features. Thinks you want to know what the old guy's got his sights set on. Anyway, we should meet up with the mask soon. Do we have to? I really like it here. Good, because we'll be back tonight to clean ourselves some muck and mire. Oh, okay. Muck and mire. Specifically uses that code phrase. Hmm. Yup. Perfect. Well, I'm really glad we stayed put now. They went and gave the, uh, they went and gave the game away just like that. Mask certainly has to refer to C, while well, the muck and mire part must be in reference to the muck and mire that gathers in the Vermilion City. And those two must be members of the Reborn Imperial Liberation Front. Much as I'd rather not believe that two young girls like that are involved in terrorism. Well, Miss Cotton Candy sure made it sound like this is business as usual for her. Got work reeling in the big one, guys. Are we not going to follow them? She said their cleaning up was going to take place tonight. If we wait till then, we may be able to catch the rest of them at work as well. I agree. We don't want them noticing us and risk C not showing. It won't be much longer, but tonight we'll put you, we'll be that much closer to our next step. And the, and she knew. Nadia knew, right? She has to have known that they were there. What is it, Nadia? Nothing. Just weighing out who's the prey and who's the bait between us. Who's the what? Don't worry about it, LP. You don't need to understand. But I want to. Who's the prey and who's the bait? Okay. Yeah, because they're using this group as 
where they're using they're they're being baited to show themselves but these guys are baiting them to show up and deal with the 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 ebon defense force basically okay okay i like that care to share what we accomplished sure thing we actually got a lot done on our end we found several of their bases in the city plus we figured out where they'll be to meeting tonight nice work we got to try lots of good food it's a relief I wasn't expecting anything from you. Hey, that's rude! You managed to try almost all the city's best foods in a single day. I'd call that a big accomplishment in my book. It would be if that's what we were here for. Hope you weren't slacking off with her. Of course not. I worked so hard, S. You did not. You were playing around with me the whole time. See, I got my hand on Milliam Orion's Argus too. One of our targets. It's bound to be full of juicy info. What? When did you get that? Do you remember that blue hair girl you bumped into? Her name's Milliam. Wait, then the reason I tripped was... Yep, because I threw out some thread. How could you? That's so mean! I didn't have this when you bumped into her. That, does, that doesn't excuse ruining my crepe. What if I took you on another food adventure to make up for it? Then all will be forgiven. <laughs> You've got the poor girl wrapped around your finger already, huh? Seems we've all accomplished a little something. I'd say so, yeah. So, all good. All good. The stage is set. We need only to wait for the curtain to rise. Okay. Love it. <laughs> so I feel like Lo I feel like Lloyd's story is the one that's going to be the oddest one out of this because like these two are Let us begin. like these two are hard interconnected the reen and c1 hard interconnected right now lloyd is kind of on the outskirts still in crossville <laughs> i don't know what you think you're up to but we're gonna put a stop to it no you're not consider your escape route blocked yeah well well if it isn't the rabbits from the intelligence division there's another three no Five of them. <laughs> Howdy. You did well to find us, Class 7. Not really. All we had to do was use the signal from my Arcus 2 to track you. You don't have to unveil every little thing. <laughs> Why would you tell them? Doesn't matter that she did. They wanted to lure us here. That is true. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> ah, you figured it out, huh? I mean... Since you have been lured... It is time we introduced ourselves. Hmm. I mean, there'd be, I feel like, very, like, her using the term muck and mire just randomly, obviously alluding to the message, makes, like, makes it a lot more, like, obvious. It's like, yeah, we're trying to lure you, because who's going to just say that? I am C, leader of the Reborn Imperial Liberation Front. The Relf. And I'm, uh, Noin, same group. Noin. <laughs> I... You can call me Dry then, I guess. Dry. <laughs> nine. Dry. Yeah. Yeah, because so, yeah, it's three and nine. But, you know, German, nine and Dry is three. Yep. Wait, huh? <laughs> if, if you must address me, then call me Lep. Dolly! Call me Dolly. <laughs> Did you just snort at me? You fuck. I think it suits you. <laughs> Dolly. Look at our widow Dolly. Isn't she the cutest thing? <laughs> Nadia, God. I, you can almost, you can hear how much fun the voice actress for Nadia is having, and I really, I'm here for it. Mm -hmm. I knew dynamite came in small packages, but now terrorists do too, huh? Is this truly the same group that captured me and her highness? No. No. They borrowed their name at most. The original one's been disbanded for sure. Yeah. What do you think reborn means? Just who are you, C? Don't worry about it. Maybe I don't know the answer to that just yet. But I do know it isn't the same as it was the first time around. What the fuck are you talking about? It's Crow Armbras, dude. It would be hilarious. Why tell you what half the fun is in the mystery? Tell us why you abducted His Highness and Lady Sherazard. And why you stole my Arcus too. And why you want us here. All valid inquiries, but we are not at school, and I am not your instructor. <laughs> I don't have to tell you. I'm under no obligation to answer anything you ask. <laughs> oh, we get that. 
You'll only wish you did after we beat the ever-living hell out of you. Gehenna. That could prove very effective, but only if you have enough strength to make good on your threat. Well, Yo, am I gonna fight? Yo, who am I playing as, though? That's the main question. We'll who am I playing as? Enough. And also, does the other team have what we have equipped? <laughs> Try not to let ah. the guards down. Okay, so I'm... Get him, Dolly! Of course! He'll regret messing with me! Can't you two read the room? Reduce all enemies' HP to a certain amount. Okay. About half... Oh, God, I need to... Um, okay, battle scope. Let's see... Yeah. Angmax Sol, who is the most likely suspect in kidnapping of the royal couple, they goad their enemies with elegant swordplay. Um, who do I want to have? Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Order. Um, I'm going to Black Tortoise just to reduce damage because she's gonna do something. Um, Stadia. Okay, cute girl with a teddy in hand, though often underestimated at first. Her arts and needles prove her a force to be reckoned with. Okay. Sure. Let's... Zero craft, so let's do this. My mind is clear. Because that will do big damage. <laughs> Since CP. Sure. Okay, that did not do nearly as much damage as I was expecting. Okay, yeah. yeah. Let's get Lapis. Yeah, okay. A dainty girl who brandishes an axe thrice her size. The joints on her limbs suggest she is not human, but she's in disguise still. Um, thrice her size. Is it actually thrice her size? <laughs> ah, dick. Dick. I shall go. Okay, and then you can at least use detector. Search mode activated. Instead Scan of complete. Uh, a collected boy who uses a pair of strange swords. His deft movements and decisive actions help him control the map. See, the dumb part, or I don't want to say the dumb part, but like the sensible part, is that it does call them Nadia, Swin, Lapis, and C, um, instead of using any of the names that they gave themselves. Um, okay, so let's... Uh, let's do Raging Fire. Here I go! And... This'll be fun! Okay. So... So this is one. If I do Belial Raid, I'll at least get them all and I'll be crit and boosted. So yeah, let's do that. Come on, let's have ourselves a dance. I ain't done with you yet. It is so bad, I don't want to be hurting my other team. <laughs> I like these guys. <laughs> Sweet dreams. Sweet dreams. <coughs> nice. I shall go. Okay. Four. Could do this. Um, the CP plus thirty. EP plus fifty. Yeah. Let's do. Fatal heart. Oh. There we go. Just gonna take this zero craft. My mind is Because uh, 200 CP. Empty. You know, honestly, I could do it again. <laughs> If this doesn't uh, do everything, as a flash, shredded leaves, as a flash. No. Just do they it again. Need a little nap. You'll 
paint for this. Darn it. We gotta go. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, second one. Interesting clean. that Edel Heart is My a move used by Lapis, but affects C, so it like puts him in enhanced. Not the other way around. That's more like it. There we go. They're strong. Class Seven's got the chops to back up their rep. I mean, they did. They they have saved the. the the country a few times. Giving up so soon, children? I was just taking five. We're only just getting started. Now, it, now okay. it's opposite. Time okay. For round two. Okay. You're dealing with us. There's nowhere left to run. Yeah. So you be ready for a fight. See, this one's gonna be a bit harder because the other ones have. Okay, but I'm not fighting Reen. Okay. <laughs> Ansible delayed by six uh, for six turns. Cast time minus that. Damage reduction. Okay, I'll do this to reduce the delay. Um, I'm gonna set up a mark on hopefully all Target of them. Locked. Okay, let's do that. Very well. Okay. Adamus Ripper. Okay, so let's get to Ash. The doll sees all. The doll sees all. Hmm. Student so class seven, though his do. movements appear wild, his cool judgments easily upset the flow of battle. All right. So later. Delay. Then delay. That would be pretty nice. Um, but let's do this. Tina. <laughs> Student of class seven, also known as the Black Rabbit. Her combat shell, Clom Soleis, supports allies while also crushing allies. <laughs> Missed. Unfortunately, uh -huh. you're... Fortunately, your range is not all that great. <laughs> that boost. The cure all. Cure all would be nice. Um, so rural cannon. Item. Battle scope. Elliot. Release. Yeah. her out. Student, uh, student council president at St. Estrella's Girls School. Who, her dainty appearance belies the steely spirit felt in every cut of her blade. Good. I shall. You emerald eye again on you. The doll sees all. Hmm. Congratulations. So this is what uh, you Thor's do. class seven. Loved across the continent as a musician. Even foes are helpless to the notes of his siren song. Yeah. Ah. I'll take care of it. Okay, so now let's do this. I'm gone. Okay. Uh, How about this? It's Renegade Edge. Renegade Edge! Not for sleep. Ask it for it. Crits on. Ready? Um. I'm gonna Soul Blur. For it's no me. reason other than the fact that, yeah, can I do that? Uh, very but now well. I want to do this because this will no get the choice. crit. It doesn't use its 200 CP. Uh, it's a guaranteed crit Here because goes. they're marked. Heel swing. So, good. Very well. Okay. Animus Ripper. Good. Okay. Good. Ooh, froze. That's low. Oh, yeah, he, they, okay, they're, so they're all gonna get enhanced if I it's don't do me. enough damage. Um, reduction, delay, EP cost, minus. Let's do that, because that will increase. How shall we play? Attack. Okay. EP 
Come in here. For that. Get the crit. As well as this. And then I can just craft with maybe Nadia. After this, if it's not enough. Yes, unfortunately, I don't have Mark on me, but. But there's a crit turn. Maybe I should take a break. Y you're strong. I'm giving it all I have. Okay, so you got next. You're almost there. You're a bit farther out. Let's just go here. Edge. My turn. Time being. Yeah, it's not like How you were we play? too, uh, too high up there. Okay. <laughs> On it. They're down. Break. Yeah. Needle shoot. This will do plenty of damage. Good. I gotta back out for a bit. Okay. I like that, where it's like, hey, you get to fire as one than the other. Just just to give it even. If my arc is too back already! Yay! <laughs> Here you go. Hope you like the bomb I put inside. What? <laughs> Milliam! Milliam! Ah! Boom! Kidding! See you later! <laughs> I didn't actually put a bomb in there! <laughs> yeah, you faked happened? out. <sighs> they got away. But to where? Hmm. Did the wind pick up now or something? Wait, I get what's going on. I understand. Yeah, no. I mean, like, how are you feeling a draft from over they there? They fled underground. Yeah. Should we pursue them? Yes. After we update Representative Regnitz. They can't have gone far. Unless they're really fast, then they could have gone really far. These underground passages never get any less gloomy. Feels as though this one has been seeing a lot of use lately. Looks that way. Could see group be using it as a hideout? That seems rather unlikely. Yeah, if that was the case, they probably wouldn't want to lure us down here. Let's just keep going. I'm sure we'll find an answer further in. Agreed. But watch out. I can send some pretty tough monsters down here. Okay, so that was a cool sequence. I was like, hey, I'm gonna fight, you're gonna fight, we're all gonna fight, we all love fighting. Okay, so now we are back to green. So let's come over here, take a little, little pit stop. Quartz, couldn't make some quartz. Uh, like, it's, it's, I know I should probably be upgrading people's slots. But there, there are so many characters now, I'm like, I don't know whose slot to, like, care about the most, I guess, if that makes any sense. Right, where it's like, oh yeah, no, I have plenty of slots. AT delay halved. Interesting that it just says AT delay have, not like for any, like, not for what specific thing. Um, but I do have a, a golden bell. So maybe I should check to see who has said golden bell. That's shining R. Shining! Okay. There! Yeah, okay. Regardless, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, so I feel like at some point I'm just going to be playing a crap ton of Is every corridor. entrance? Purely Looks like it leads somewhere of, different uh, than where we've been before. Getting a whole bunch of Sabbath, upgrading everyone. It seems C just came through. Here. <laughs> if we hurry, we could still catch up. They're gonna get it for what they did to my Arcus too. They even do anything to your Arcus too, or did they just take it and say that there was a bomb in it? <laughs> Is this a storage area? Seems like it. certainly looks that way. There's a ton of food here. 
most much of it non-perishable. You know, tomatoes. You know, and well known to be non-perishable. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, Yusus? Likely so. This must be where all of those bulk purchases William and I were looking into ended up. This is the last place I would have thought to look. The goods were right under our doorstep the whole time. This area is full of guns. The same kind that the Imperial Army uses, too. I think it's safe to assume the rebels in the army were the ones who supplied these. I see armaments, ammo, fuel, too. Quite a stockpile. Got a hand to them. The muck that gathers in the Vermilion City, indeed. I think it's reasonably likely there are storage areas like this elsewhere, too. Which means we're dealing with a significant amount of supplies. And that begs the question of what they're planning on using all this stuff for. Whatever it is, it can't be anything good. Either way, we need to focus on catching C for now. Let's get moving. Oh yeah, we need to focus on that. Ha! Ready. <laughs> As though he didn't lead you down here so you can see it. Found. Rage, yo! Counterattacks after evading all the deal crit. Damn, that's an er act uh, accuracy 100 and 10% of it. That's pretty damn good. Um, do I have anyone built right now for evasion? No, in fact, Reen is the one most likely to evade. Um, and I could get him up to 30 with more, but... Uh, ah, okay. So, here we go. Let's get that. So... Ah, okay, so you can only have one tag along per group. Okay, interesting. Okay. Reverie team. Okay, so who... Who has... You have Firebell. Seven caliber R. Yeah, I'm gonna remove that. Soul Blair R. I think if someone, if someone must have Golden Bell. Okay, there it is. Just okay. So if I. Look here, is anyone set to use? No, no one's really set to even use that spell type, so I'm not too concerned about it. Um Yeah. Okay. I just wanna I just wanna know where it was. That was that was my main thing. I wanted to know where it was. <laughs> um step action two, yeah, I'll just have you chrono drive R so you can cast that. We have the advantage. Okay. Neo Roach. Okay. Need to take this. This will be fun. to Here I go. Up their uh, CP again. Here. I'll assist. Engaging. Mm. I'll save you so much. I'm, I'm up. Ha. Sure. Arts, Venom Pain. Here I go. Uh, My turn. Sled. Sure. Let's go. Yeah. Thank you. I'm ready. Engaging. Attack. Good. I'll go. Let's BP. go. Number. I'm so proud of so, what we've so, done. Uh, at least getting big, big XP. That's fine. What reason could they have had for fleeing underneath the city? It would appear to have been a spontaneous decision to the untrained eye. But there is most certainly something calculated to it. Mm. You hear that noise coming from farther in? Let's hope it's not anything <laughs> bad. Okay. So let's, let's get take care of you guys. Double sickle. 
You can Search do mode that. Active. Details procured. Spectral beast that haunts the underground after its deafening roar paralyzes your senses. Its two sickles will come in for the kill. A counter. Engaging. Good. Arcus activated. Numbers up. Ah, yeah. Got him. In there. Now it's full. Ah. In it. I'm up. Ah. Ah. Yourself. Thank you. I shall go. It's tough. We'll need to be careful. Kato Peblos. Uh, okay. Let's whack you. Sure. Zero order. And ninety percent damage reduction for eight turns. Noble arc strength all up. Damage was thirty for eight. For harmony damage reduction for ten. Hunt, crit, crystal, yeah, let's do Inferno. Go for sir. Numbers up. Kato Beblas. Uh, Pepla. Beb. Beplas. Beplas. There we go. Oh, I just realized you had, like, the eyes. That's weird. You look a lot weirder now. Uh, a bovine from another dimension. The eye on its forehead and its massive horns are fixed on its prey until they breathe their last. Here I go. It's weird hearing the term prey and bovine in the same <laughs> sentence, but not no! the bovine is the prey. I'll assist. thing. Turns, accuracy, strength, okay. A lot of things give accuracy in this game, I'm noticing. Like a lot of a lot of courts as their like sub ability are given. I don't think that one will play nice. A powerful enemy. Yeah, I hoping I can get a, hoping I can get something better. Um okay, you know what? Let's increase damage. And let's do an attack. For one. And, and then let's, let's have you do raid. Your belly will raid. Come on. This big damage. I'm ready. Engaging. Arcus active. Yeah. There go. Big hit. Ten thousand. Okay, we'll take that. Thank you. I'm up. Um, okay. Resonate! Sephiroth Symphony! That's... It's my turn! 
No Let's damage go. taken. Vampire bat. How many more turns do you have to go? We should get to go soon. Come through. I'm ready. Tira. Park is activated. Sure. You're mine. Yeah. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Thanks. I'll see what you so <laughs> Of all the ones that get, uh, you know, that was, that was dumb. Man. I shouldn't. Have. Shouldn't have used that move because he was going—he was going to do massive damage. Um, uh, Good luck. Leave it to me. Swap out. Sure. Useless. Engaging. Here I go. That's. Up. Back out. I'll do my best. These guys aren't really very equipped. Arcus very well. Arcus activate. What's the casting going on? Huh. There's even more. Okay, good. So you guys are better. Yes. Arcus activate. It's my turn. Arcus activate. Yeah. Let's do this. I shall go. And then Search mode activated. Details procured. Yeah. Amassing bat that hails from the netherworld, it drains the living of blood and causes bad luck to those who catch sight of it. So this should be very good because they're gonna move up and probably hurt themselves a whole bunch. There. While also getting absolutely bodied by Arts Aoes. I'll support you. Thank you so much. I'm so proud of what okay, we've done. Okay, cool. Just w wand it. Um, damn, that's a lot of XP. Um, ooh, and like you can even see Kaleido like getting 4,000 XP. That's really good. Galleon Fort, 85% chance to get attacks from crafts and stuff. Um, obtain 7 from offensive arts, that's good. But no boost to the nice. XP amount. <laughs> nice! But that's the Belly Raid 2! Yo, okay, okay, okay. Be like Stats that. Updated. But that's, um. A matter, of course. That, that's going to be really good. Ultimate very EX, self physical immunity. Yay, I uh, did it! Is going to be the really good part about like that, where it's like, okay, this is, you're just going to get a whole bunch of Sabbath. Pretty regularly. Um, okay. So, let's do our swap out. Go. Okay, so that's there. Beginning yeah, combat. Just hoping. Murder organ. Now. It's mine. And... I'm in Nova. Park is active. This will be fun. Void breaker ex. Got something to die. I shall go. Charging. <laughs> Fool. Fool. There. Yeah. Thank you. I'm up. Crimson Flash. I'll fight. Yeah. My turn. <sighs> this will be fun. Uh, I'm up. Ha. <laughs> go. And now to keep going. Easy enough. <laughs> Million leveled. Big deal. Brave sea. Woohoo! Rare booty! Rare booty! You say. Okay, everyone's gonna be at full CP, gonna have full charge. It's gonna be nice. Over here, arrest. Okay. Gonna be going into this sequence basically as prepared as I possibly could be. Save, good. Quip. Probably 
should have you with something on. Dressage, ATS plus 120, speed plus 4. Yes, we pursue. Okay, let's do that. Spider stone brooch. Crimson emblem. Can't okay, do that. Okay. Let's seal. Yeah. Answer gear. Oh, okay, cool. Didn't I forgot that I had picked that up and just didn't equip it. Sometimes I'm like, oh yeah, no, they just give it to you, right? No, they don't just give it to you. <laughs> or not, not just like give it to you, but they don't just like auto equip it. Okay. Wait, I think I hear voices. Yeah, there are a lot of people further down the passage. More of C's allies, perhaps? It could be the re army rebels. Or both. Maybe that so-called muck is currently mid-cleanup. They're not fighting, from what I can tell. Let's see if we can listen in. the Imperial Army and the EDF. So they are connected. That confirms our suspicions. You've done a fine job of making such thorough preparations in such short time. We owe it all to your support, and you have our thanks. Helping those who share your ideals is common sense. You needn't thank us. Incidentally, here's the item we were discussing. It's an experimental replica, so the only one exists, I'm afraid. But I'm sure you'll be able to make good use of it. Absolutely. Our cherished ambition of defeating the Republic was crushed before our eyes. And now new armored divisions like ours are being disbanded one after another. How are we supposed to quietly endure such humiliation as proud citizens of the Empire? Chancellor Osborne charted the course this country should be following. Now it falls to us to walk the path. Exactly, and while he may no longer be with us, Supreme Leader Rufus Albaray is following in his footsteps. Even if we should join the United Nation, our pride as Erebonians shall be eternal. You said it. I couldn't agree more. <laughs> Your words are most reassuring. Do you foresee any impediments to our plan? We do not. We've already reached out to our allies, and our forces will assemble tomorrow morning. All that leaves is for the leaders of our group to gather here to go over the details once more. Before the sun sets tomorrow, this city will fall. They're planning a coup d'etat? And tomorrow, no less. We're in worse trouble than I thought. Can't let them take over the capital. We can't. And that's why it's good that we're here right now. I agree. If all of the coup d'etat's leaders are gathered here, as they say, capturing them now should put a stop to their machinations. So I get to bash skulls. Tight. Those do they know that they have just sealed their own fates. I will aid you however I can. I look forward to I look forward to hearing of your success. And you will in short order. We will tear down this false government and return the Empire to how it should be. You're not tearing down anything. Tear down this wall. Mr. Gorbachev, tear down this wall. What? Who goes there? We're Thor's Military Academy's Class 7. Here by request a provisional representative Regnitz to arrest you. Give up and come quietly. The Ashen Chevalier? <laughs> how the hell did he find us? Well, we were led here. We're leaving. Our work is done here. Void Breaker! Yo, use the move. No, it doesn't go long enough. Crystal Edge! Aerial Dust! Yo, just using the moves. Damn. Damn it. We were just a little short. <laughs> As fast as they are cowardly. We can worry about them once we've dealt with the more pressing threat. Mm, and Listen, there's four of them. The war is over. I understand you don't like how it ended. But what good is organizing a coup d'etat going to do? Silence! We're not interested in a word you have to say, hero. You're a filthy traitor, Ashen Chevalier. So many of us joined the army to follow in your footsteps. 
only for you to trample all over our ambitions. You couldn't possibly understand the frustration of those who died in that war, or even those left behind. It's time you took responsibility for your actions. Damn. <laughs> well, time to I fight you. I think yeah. you need to take responsibility for your actions first. Indeed. Only the truly weak try to blame others for their own failings. Hmm. Guess you're too weak to see the obvious. If you don't understand that, then you have no right to lecture any of us. Thank you, everyone. <laughs> and Ashen just be like, I want to beat their shit up. Any more kind words are wasted on them. <sighs> Enough of this. Now that you've seen us here, you won't be leaving alive. <laughs> like you're strong enough to stop us. <laughs> Our numbers are roughly even. But I've heard of Class 7 strength. We'd be fools to challenge you head on. Fortunately, we just received a useful tool that's simply begging to be tested. How about we give it a trial run before tomorrow's main event? Mm. I don't know what you're planning, but I suggest you surrender at once. Yeah! Now that I've got my Arcus 2 back, you won't be getting off lightly. You're squaring up against the Millie and Tilly plus Lammy and Sammy combo, and you're not gonna like the punches it packs. They're very big and mechanical. It pains me greatly to let that terrible name pass. But this is hardly the time. Hey, Neko Dave, how's it going, my man? Hope you're doing well. Long Soleus. Error got one. Yo, is that a? I wonder. Is that? Yeah, that's um, that's like the one from Sky. That's um, a testament, right? Turns off orbits. What just happened? Yup. My orbital staff isn't responding. Yup. Neither is my battle orbment. Yup. How did you disable all of our orbital devices? Not bad, thank you. I'm doing well, you know, it's Friday, so got off work. Didn't really do much work today. Worked from home, quote unquote, worked, uh, because all my work was done yesterday. Um, but yeah, no, doing good. Uh, just advanced, uh, well, got out of Reverie Corridor and then advanced uh, the C plot and the Ream plot, so having a grand old time. Just did the, just did the, their back and forth fight, which was fun. Could this be the same phenomenon that was documented in Liberal four years ago? Yes. And the thing looks exactly the same. So you're up the society's ass too, huh? <laughs> you're all suckling on that society teat. We're not obligated to tell you anything. Well, you could, if you want. But now, only four of you can face us in combat. <laughs> because we know exactly how many of you are physical attackers. <laughs> eh. Eh, sorry. Just adjusting my... Cheer. I can hardly believe it's this effective. The originals brought the orbital shutdown phenomenon, and this is a perfect replica. The gospel are gospel, all but that's means not Valflame Palace's defenses are as good as nothing. Ah, and you have hounds. Well, how do you like your odds now? We don't stand a chance of losing. You do realize that if we destroy that device and capture you all, your coup d'etat is doomed to fail, right? Ha! <laughs> That's not happening. All right? This fight's on us. We can do this as long as we fight as a team. Oh, I hate that we have to just sit here. Maybe you should get swole. Do something. Learn a weapon. I agree. But all we can do is leave this to those who can fight. Don't worry. They'll be able to cover us. We won't let you down. Not being able to use orbital arts is a hindrance. But it's hardly a faithful one. Yeah. You better be ready for the squad. beating of a lifetime. Strength. Okay. Be careful. <laughs> it's my turn. Um, okay. Sword, black dove, and rifle, rifle, rifle. Okay. So, item, battle scope. Yeah. Let's get these out of the way. Lee soldier attempting a coup d'etat to reignite the war now with the gospel R. He barrages helpless victims with powerful swords. Very cards. well. Um, you know what? F it. Let's Divine just, shield. Protect us. Just, let's just have that. Rifle. Yeah, Lee soldier attempting a coup d'etat to reignite the war. His shots never miss. Except when they do. Numbers up. Okay. Now let's do Hold this. Out. Keep the damage sure. down. Battle scope. 
that rifle is the same as that rifle is the same as that rifle, so the Dovin is just the only thing that I need to worry about. Okay, uh, military beast trained under the Ebon Defense Force. It specializes in chasing down and crushing prey with its sharp fangs. So how far have you gone in, uh, in uh, Reverie uh, and Echo Dave? I'm up. Okay, zero craft. Let's do this. I'm up. Let's do. Galliel Raid 2. This will do. Come on, damage. let's have ourselves a dance. <laughs> nice big demand. Plus boost. But the so Siru Ah, okay. Fun. Fun, fun, fun. Yeah, I'm so excited to like go more and more into the sea room because I want to. Oh, I'm not linked with anyone. Oh, can I not link because of the Orman thing? I have to check. Dude, look at all that damage. Lone Let's blade. Go. Okay, yeah, I can't link. Um. Okay. Actually, you know what? Uh, you are. Let's do this. And do this again. Good. This is it. <laughs> because the other one was a zero craft, so this one's also a zero craft. Come on, let's have ourselves. <laughs> so if this doesn't do it, I could just also again S craft with Ash to have three of his S crafts in a row, and the first one was boosted by uh, Lone Blade. All boosted by raging fire, no less. <laughs> <laughs> this is it. Just so much. Come on. Dude, zero craft is so. It's such a good like turn yeah. effect now. <laughs> it's so good. More enemies. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, I did not. Okay. It's well, I, hmm. I. I blew my metaphorical load a little early. Hmm. Hmm. No. I didn't blow. It. I didn't. I didn't mess up too bad. Uh, okay, so let's Hold out. take a, take some defense again. Huh. And let's take a look, see at all their people again, all their people and stuff. Okay. Um, craft. Actually, probably. Uh, wait. Uh, just hoping there'd be more. Battle scope. Yeah. Officer. At least soldier turned a coup d'etat or ignore or his blade can fell any foe. Bull Very well. Shit. Ooh, you are sealed. That's not good. Okay. Battle scope. Anyone to heal? Seal. Seal. Anyone else sealed? No. Huh. Should drop that there. Let's go. Okay. Now the only thing I can do is raging fire. So it's raging fire. fire. Blazing swarm. Let's go. Let. Yeah. A little bit. Numbers up. Let's do. Rumbling smash. You're mine. Undo one of them. And I'll do this so I can get zero craft on. My mind is two hundred CP. This way, I need to delay them. Someone. Okay. Do 200 CP again. My mind is clear. Form 100 S crafts. Just My crafty enough. Empty. I'm just crafty enough. Good. Hard slash. Ow. Here I go. Ow. Wah. Oh wait, this cures ailments of seven. I could have done that, I think. Something. 
<laughs> it's my turn. Okay, platinum shield. Sure, do that. Oh, I'll, do, I'll do one of the best moves that be is in the game. That. I'll fight. Very well. Move him. Or central. I'm up. That way, in case I want to do Leave it. it to me. Divine shield. Numbers <laughs> up. I'm ready. Let's go. Just bullying this guy. It's my turn. Numbers up. It's my turn. I'll fight. You're the one. Very well. I'm up. Yeah, you know, just just sure. in case there's another like Is group it? after this, I want to make Hell sure. Yeah. Okay. Let's keep moving. Want to make sure that there's enough. <laughs> Enough gone. Oh, I could 3.5 XP bonus. Okay, that's that's really good. So if I didn't already have the achievement, that that's where it was. But skull reach level seven, a crest, 50% uh, damage, auto HP regen. That's good. Dunamis, cross crusade, EP through attacks, crafts, boost goes up, and also offensive arts to crit. Nice. Serious level seven. Securia, counter attack damage. Insight, yes, good. That's really good. Because insight at the start just is like, hey, immediate boost on, on evasion. Nice. Which helps a That'll lot. Do it. A matter of course. Uh, see, holy soldier holy sword of Elvar. <laughs> nice. It's the holy sword of Elvar. Hey, cool. And the thing is broken and done now. And there's only one. Oh. How could we possibly lose? <laughs> How pathetic. My mess weaker, but that didn't make them any stronger. I'm glad we managed to defeat them. Yeah, you fought really well. Hey, you're back. Clom Salace. Lammy, you're back! So, what are we going to do with them? Well, goes without saying that we'll tie them up, but... Our part is what to do next. We can't just leave them. I'm not seeing seeing the others anywhere in the vicinity. Could they be further inside? There are countless hidden passages underneath the capital. They could have followed a different route from us. I want to go after the EDF too. Perhaps we should split into two groups. Class 7, correct? We're members of the military police sent here by His Excellency. Please go on ahead. We can handle everything here. Couldn't have come at a better time, strangely enough. How'd you know where to come? Uh, that's what we'll do then. Thank you for your help. Let's resume our pursuit. See, I would be like, I can't trust them. Because, obviously, the military has... Ah, has how did Class 7 know moles. where we were meeting? We kept such a close eye on them. They had no chance to get that information. Is it really okay to leave those soldiers behind? No. We've done what we've set out to do. What they do now is of no concern to us. They wouldn't have been much help in fulfilling our goal anyway. We're better off returning to Crossbell and reporting to the Supreme Leader. You won't be reporting to anyone. Mm. You will tell us everything you know, and then you will never cause trouble again. Damn it! An ambush! Yup. Who are you? I thought you'd never ask. We are the Reborn... We have no name to share with the likes of you. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Lapis keeps getting shut down. We're not here to play games. Like, I like how Lapis is just, like, one step behind on, like, the uptake every single time. Like, her getting surprised and confused is just par for the course, and I'm I'm here for it. Get them! I'll remove all who stand in my way. Lapis is the best. She's very good. Okay, and uh, because I already identified them, I don't have to worry about them, which is a fan flipping testicular. Um, okay, so uh, let us decrease the delay. Shadow step. Shadow step. Okay, we're gonna mark these two. Target locked. There we go. Uh, that's gonna appear Zavar. So I haven't done this yet. Yeah, so he brandishes and attacks in the same move. That's really good. That is really good. Like, 
Like, I can't really overstate how really good that is. Because it's not like one or the other. It's not attack or brandish. It is, I do both. That is... It's honestly obscenely good. Nadia can get the zero. Okay, bada bang, bada boom. I would have done swim so we could get the crit on uh, the two guys that I marked and then mark the other two, but he only has 94 CP. I mean, I could have done C's crit boost and that would have given him plus 15 CP, but uh, I didn't because I wanted to keep the delay. Or the delay reduction. Okay. Let's go over here. Thank you. On slash. Good. And then I'll just do this. Because now they are all going to no get crit. Huh. Yeah. No, I'm, re I'm really liking the, the Rilf. Here goes. Like. Like, the Rilf is, the Rilf is a good squad. The Rilf, Reborn Imperial Liberation. Yes, good Chris. Um, okay. So let's Soul Eater. No, okay. Why you? Good. Good. Yes. Get dodged, bro. Diamond Nova. Nice. Take that. An immediate pass. No reason not to. Good. It's me. Impossible. Yeah, not much, uh... Impossible. Cool. May we continue on. May we continue on. Yes, we may. Okay, so everyone other than Lapis is sitting at 106 now, which is good. Um, and then, yeah, Tal is in range level 6. So, good. Prevents Nuti. Like, the, the likelihood of her, like, the likelihood of someone with Talisman getting a, it's like a status or a stat down is now so minimal. Like, you have an 80, you have an 8% chance to get a status ailment. <laughs> All stats raised when HP is low. Three turns of all stat up. Damn, okay. But it's HP is low. Not much of a surprise. Aw, yeah. How? How could elite soldiers lose to a trio of children? Well, one of them isn't actually a child, and two of them are professional assassins. So don't worry about it. So, Yo. I ask if either of you are proficient in torture? Hmm. <laughs> I I really do like Lapis's weapon and how it turns into a briefcase. <laughs> like, it's such a cool weapon. Her sheathing is also very cool. It doesn't sit right with me, but I can do it if needed. <laughs> I can. I am proficient. Hmm. Yeah, I got you, boss. <laughs> oh, I can do it. I'll happily do it. The trick to torture, you see is that you've got to take it really slow. They'll need to think that they'll be able to handle the pain. Make it small and steady, then wear them down bit by bit as you inflict more and more. Nadia, you're still freaking me out. If they're willing to talk after that, then it's time to start cutting off their limbs. Oh, not all at once, of course. It starts with their toes, then their ankles and knees, then you edge up their thighs. Then it's off with their fingers, wrists, elbows, and shoulders. Oh, 
But if you just keep cutting away at body parts like that, they'll die of blood loss. That's why I stitch everything back on as I slice it off. <laughs> Lapis is getting freaked out. So you'll still have your limbs. Just they'll be prettier with thread. You'll be like a stuffed toy. Doesn't that sound wonderful? <laughs> Don't worry. I'm real good at this. I won't let you die. Nadia, you're freaking me out here. Your performance is going perfect. Still, all I'm using is an ordinary needle and thread. You won't be able to move your arms or legs. They'll be sewn to your torso. But no matter how it hurts or how you will it, it'll be like they were never yours at all. You can try your left hand or your right hand. You can try your left leg or right leg. You can try and try and try. But you'll never be able to move them again. By the way, if you just can't get enough of my thread, I'll keep going and stitch your mouth and eyelids closed. You'll still be alive, and you'll still be able to think. You just won't be able to do anything else. <laughs> Dude, this is so epic. That sure would get boring quick though, huh? I can fix that too. I can attach more string and make you dance around like a big old marionette. Oh, maybe then you could be LP's friend. I'm sure she'd like to get to know some other dolls. <laughs> no, but I do not want to know other dolls. To talk after all that, I'll just unstitch your mouth and I'll talk. I'll tell you anything. Even just the thought of it. Just, just please stop. I beg you. <laughs> please stop describing what you would do to me. <laughs> didn't even, didn't even get even touched. But you're <laughs> so scary, Nadia. Yeah. Ah. Did you think I meant all that? Yes. Then you didn't? <laughs> of course I did. <laughs> I'm behind. Stop messing with her. <laughs> Sorry. Her reactions are just so cute I couldn't resist. Uh. I was blowing smoke, LP. I don't do stuff like that anymore. Anymore? Anymore? <laughs> yeah. There are lots of things in this world that you're better off not knowing. Or... Do you want to be the marionette at the end of my thread? Uh, I'm going to scout out our route. <laughs> Bye. Don't go by yourself. You'll get lost. <sighs> be back. I'm going after her. Oopsie. She's never going to look at me the same way again. Your acting was very convincing. Well. Or was that a hearty anecdote from the past? <laughs> what did you say to those guys? Half the fun is in the mystery? Either way. Consider me impressed. Mm. I thought it was my imagination at first, but one's gut instinct exists for a reason. Eager as you appear to earn your riches through my offer, you did so with much greater caution than Swin. I mean, Swin also probably wasn't going to accept the deal. <laughs> um, unless uh, Nadia would push them to do it. Your guard is high even as we speak. <sighs> You're slick. Swin might look like he handles our work just fine, but his heart bleeds more than the blood he spills. He's not made for this life. That's why it's up to me to handle the unpleasant side of things. I see. You make for quite the ideal duo, I must say. Why, thank you. You each boast unparalleled skill in some respects. And significant flaws in others. Yet your strengths and weaknesses compensate for one another's like two pieces in a jigsaw. It's as if you were carefully selected and trained to become a perfect pair. We're not together because of that. You call us two pieces in a jigsaw, and it's clear you enjoy treating us like fun parts of a mystery to be fitted in a greater puzzle. Yeah, but that's not what people are. But two can play at that game, see. It's been a couple days now. I've already got a good idea on just who you are. There are still questions that need answering for it to make sense, so I can't say I know with complete certainty. But I'd bet on me being right. How fortunate for me that I've hired one of your intellect. <laughs> good thing you're under my employ. I'm gonna make this painfully clear. If you stab us in the back, no. If you so much as cause the slightest harm to us, 
You'll spend every waking moment of the rest of your life wishing you hadn't. And if I were to view that another way, I have nothing to fear so long as I do nothing of the sort. Hmm. <laughs> and <laughs> silver lining, if I don't do that thing, then I'm safe. We shall remain good, happy friends for as long as we're together. I'd rather not lose two capable hired hands. And I imagine you would rather not lose your chance at the mirror. Am I wrong? <laughs> nope. Not even a little. You yeah. may be a total villain, but you keep it simple. And I like that about you. See, I like the I like this, where it's like, okay, now that Swin isn't here, Nadia can kinda like let down a little bit of like the the airy facade where she's like, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm talking serious with C because, like, I don't care. I don't care what C thinks of me. <laughs> like, oh god, these mm, character dynamics is so delicious. Oh, but don't take it like a schoolgirl crush. I already have the love of my life. A pity that he sees you as no more than an exasperating little sister. Oh, see, I thought they were like mutually. <sighs> of course, you noticed. Fuck. Okay, so that that's why she wants the Baba Boom. <laughs> okay, because I, I had thought that they were just like, okay, let's... Well, you know what? No. Yeah, no, because even at the end of 3 and 9, it's not... Yeah, no, he is a bit... He is a bit dense. I'm okay. working on it, alright. Then I wish you well. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> he noticed. <laughs> Don't take what I said seriously, okay? I was just being cute. Swear. Cute? Cute is a choice. And what'd you two follow that up with? Oh, small talk. Nothing worthy of note. <laughs> Nothing worthy. Nothing worthy of note. I shall! Surely not worthy of note. Not a very, very serious and interesting conversation. Uh, uh, okay, so I actually want to go tactics. I'm gonna swap out these two. Um, yeah, powerful strike, auto charge, and Akira, Dallas. Yeah. Let's do that. Uh, costumes, let's remove thing, that way we can see all her joints. Come on. Anything about it. Hell Slugger, Vampire Bat. You don't like water, you don't like time. Mm. Are you by now? Ask you for it on it. Over here. Target look. You're down! You're up! And let's do that. All right. Criminal. Do galleon for probably decent or yeah. Let's do My turn. Hell's all sees all. <laughs> I Get a cannon creature straight out of Gehenna. It's seemingly unlimited firepower makes the land run uh, run with the rivers of blood. Uh, Ow. Uh, Ow. Not with me. Ow. My turn. And ready. Zero craft, nice. Ready? We love just initial zero craft. Always fun. Uh, let's take Nadia again. Welcome. Because it's 200. Oop, On and it. random abnormality. We'll take that. Mark it. Good. Alright. I shall. Another. Gotta, gotta keep it up. 
good. Nana, you're so amazing. <laughs> I know, right? Nadia, you're so amazing. And but of course. But of Even course. perfection can stand to improve. <laughs> See, Adelhar. Okay, so this is the move that she used. Okay, self, strength, ADS, defense, four turns, CP, third. Okay. Uh, it releases output limiter, healing one's physical self while boosting one's abilities. Okay, so how'd she use it on someone else? Because I could have sworn it was she used Adel's heart and C's uh, stuff went up. Okay. That monster looks hard. Find I'll trounce you twice as hard. Zero. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Zero crap, so. No reason not to take Ready? it. Okay. And now let's uh, actually let's do this. Hey. Arkansas. How shall we play? So we'll cannon. Okay, you can use battle scope. <laughs> so, no, you are greater devil, powerful divine, more powerful devil. High-ranking devil called from Gehenna, it attacks with its sharp claws and powerful arts. There. And buff it. Buff it. Yay. Buff that and spell. And just do it. Boom. Get broke. On it. Okay. So then we'll here. They're Mark down. Yeah. You're up. All right. Good. Zero arts. Go. How shall we play? Mm, uh, Buff. Good. Random ailment. Death blow. We love death blow. We love it when it happens. A treasure chest. Gimme, Feels gimme. like it's cheating, honestly. Um, strength ATS thirty, HP hundred. Heart. EP. Oh, it's EP. What? Interesting. I was not expecting that. No. Hey. Target low. Yeah. Keep at it. You're up. Okay. It's me. Are you back? Oh, God damn it. I'd keep her safe. Really? I'll take care of it. <sighs> okay, do you. Mom. See, that Appreciate really it. sucks. Only because. I can keep going. Because it's, to my tech it's a lot of CP that I just did not get to use with Swim. Releasing output limiter. Good. I shall. Okay. <laughs> Good. So this should kill. Yeah. A Rosenberg doll simply cannot be beat. Oh, that's nice. That's a, that's a good finish. That's that's cute. 
And she's only just barely taller than C when she's standing on it. Not much of a surprise. Okay, good. So he's gonna be back. Zoom zone. Okay, self strength speed up four turns. CP plus twenty for four turns. Interesting. <laughs> the cherry on top. Uh, Thready bear. Wrap enemies and threads attached to the needles, piercing them to this with ways they can I and C. Area L set weak for two turns. KO. Weak two turns. Isn't that the isn't that the isn't that the Toa only uh status element? I've got where I want you. Okay, zoom zoom. <laughs> Okay. Do soul leader. I shall. Some doll. Adamus Ripper. It's me. What's going on with Threaty Bear? Should be around here. Found ya. Up you go. Threaty Bear. Threaty Bear. Got you. Okay, I'll do a burst. You for the whole Why not? Gang. Yeah. I, I haven't really done burst much, and I know there's an achievement associated with it, so. Damn it, why did I get that? Target low. You're down! You're up! And I'll take care of it. I really do love Zero Graph. It makes it, it makes it so much more fun. Like, you can be a lot more willy-nilly with s crafts. It's so good. Hey, do you like using s crafts? Yes! Here's this thing that makes it so you can just use them even more than you already were. And you thought you were probably using them a lot anyway. Ooh, interesting. We'll need to be smart around that one. <laughs> yes, we will. Um, okay, just realized that I have not saved. There we go. Well, find it. I'll trounce you twice as hard. Do that. Okay. Let's. I think they kind of stuffed caring about balance. I mean, like, I feel like they had to have just realized, like, okay, our cast is too big. We want to do too much stuff with it. We want to keep adding systems, right? There's only so much we can, quote, unquote, balance this game. Yeah, and just said have fun. Exactly. It's like, eh, realistically, we're not going to get anything even relatively close to balance. Because, like, they're, like, unless they basically nerfed it to point of it not being fun, Right, it was going to be unbalanced some way, but they don't want it to be not fun. They just want it to be whatever. Zoom zone. Very well. Zoom zoom zoom. Okay. Do Here that. On it. Okay. And let's. Uh, now let's. Yeah, let's Venom Flame. It's and me! You can do Nadia special. Welcome to my Ted Detox. Ted Detox? <laughs> so Ted Talks are a thing in this world. Good to know. <laughs> yeah, let's do Nadia special again because why not? Good. Ooh, and it's also frozen. Auto charge. You deserve some praise. Yeah. Welcome to my it's like, like, oh, it's so good. And I still know, I still have yet to look up whether or not, um, 
the zero crafts are based off of just like a hundred CP like damage, or if it's based off of the CP that the character has. Like me doing it with Nadia is better because she has 200 CP versus if I were to do it with someone else and they only have 100. Um, I've yet to look into that. Very well. No. Ready? They're down. Yeah. No. Good. You picked the wrong opponent to mess with. Nice. Look at all those. C leveled up. Ooh, and my Charb and Talisman are almost level seven. Altair level seven. Chrono break. High HP increases break damage. Raise the speed when battle uh, when battle begins. Low. Auto HP regen. We like that. Vega level seven. Flare butterflies. Defensive R steel crit. AT delay after fire arts, yo, we love that. That's a, but of course, um, that's a built-in partial bell. That's what we like to see. Now, if I could see, I'm so excited for when I'll get to like move my fire bell over to her from like the other parties because I th I've stated it before, but like fire isn't one of the. Uh, element types that I've ever really associated with casters all that much. I've never had like a a fire element caster. So Nadia is kind of the first one that's built that way. So I'm honestly really excited for like building her further. Look, the wall opened up a whole secret passageway. Especially because she's probably one of like the it's like best, a cool trick straight out of a heist novel. Like, best casters from I the start of the game. No novel could compare to the real thing. Novel. But yeah, like, Nadia is one of the best casters just from out the gate. Because she starts the game with Baron Bear the Seventh, that decreases cast time by 66%. Like, you, that, that, I don't, I think that this is a accessory that is going to carry her throughout the entire game. And now that I'm thinking about it, it's like, oh yeah, if you, like, unless there are better ones by end game, if you go into New Game Plus and keep everything, that means you'll get a second Baron Bear the Seventh. And that means you can have both on her at the same time, and her cast will be instantaneous, and then it'll just be a matter of uh, cutting the delay, like, afterwards. Um, whether it through uh, bells or whatever. And if I remember right, you like there's probably a fire bell and then the like the advanced fire bell. You can have both of those on and then whatever the master course has. OP DLC that. Oh, is Baron Bear the Seventh DLC? I didn't realize. I thought that was just a thing that she started with. Okay, I didn't yeah, let me uh advantage glasses, Shanna Floy friends. Three ingredients. Is it in like the accessory? No, it doesn't seem like it'd be the accessories. Um, I would have thought it would have been something else. But okay, interesting. Or maybe it was like originally DLC, but in this version they just like give it to you base. I don't know. I'd have to check. Um, let's save after that. Yeah, I don't have it. Okay. Well, at least it's really good. I think we're almost at the exit. The accessory set, maybe? Maybe. Wait. Hmm? What's wrong? I don't know. Just something is off. We have a little experience dealing with the spiritual entities of higher planes, I'm sure. I wonder if the Sea Sands mask thing works now. That's why I have not. I, I didn't even want to risk accidentally doing it. Which is why I did not take the DLC. I was like, nope, you're the only one that I'm not taking because I do not want this to to, to happen. Even, even, I don't want the potential for it to accidentally happen, so I'm just not even going to. <laughs> then it's time you gain some. Draw your weapons. Yo, oh, okay, look at you. Weird chariot thing. Departed General, Baleful Raider. That's one thing that Falcom is really good at. They are really good at making just weird demon-looking things. I, lo I love it. What is that? 
I'm not scared. I'm not scared. That's not your average monster. Looks like a devil straight out of the church's teachings. This route leads to a cemetery. No doubt one rife with the regrets and anger of the former living. That unrest, along with the stimulation of the spirit veins, must have caused it to manifest. Hmm. Whatever it's doing, we need to smash it out of our way. What excellent spirit! Dark Eclipse. Oh, you have a cutaway. EP cost, CP cost 150%. Four turns. Okay. Nurse Nadia's here. here. I'm here for you. Very well. Okay. Um, sure. You know what? 30 the for this is bad. Hmm. So uh, a general of Gehenna made living due to the spear veins distortions. His chariot, fueled by wrath, leaves mountains of corpses in its wake. However, you know what? No matter how cool this chariot guy is, I mean, it doesn't beat Mara. Come on. Let's be real. Mara. Peak chariot design. <laughs> um, okay. God Zavar. Um. Okay, let's just go in here with regular attacks. We can do a that for big damage. Get you back. Yeah, hope for Mark. Yeah, good. It's me. Then zero art, so feel free to increase it however much. Um, I could do that, but I'm just gonna do Zerul Cannon. Buff it! Buff it! Yeah. Good. Nice. My turn! Your turn? Your turn, you say? Um, okay. Let's... You know, let's do this. Decrease delay. This also well. boosts strength, but this will boost it some more. Initiating process. Health. That's fine. I'm just gonna have to heal her. Here. I'm here for you. Here. Good. How shall we play? Okay. So let's put. That there. Releasing output limiter. Good. So now, black you. Yay! You Earth deserve pulse. some praise. Okay. Okay. You are marked. So. Let's. Take care of it. Uh, we can. Do that. Got you. It's me. I'll do another cannon. And then I will do this. Criminal. You can come here. Mirror image. So I'm not getting very many attack beneficial turn bonuses. So I'm just gonna do this because she has strength boosted uh, to I think max 200 CP crit bonus. Or crit potential. So I think this is probably the best choice right now. Four thousand, not bad. There. Okay. Do that. On it. Good. So he's at max. I'd like to impede you, but I can't trust it. Um, you're guaranteed a crit. Nadia is probably not going to crit. Um. So I could delay or reduce the delay. Let's do that. I think that's probably safe. On it. 
three of swords, get a no crit. Choice. Should hopefully do a bit of damage. Here goes. God, I really, I really do like how his swords combine. Like, it is really cool. Cause like it brings like greater meaning to like yeah. being a person that dual wields, right? Where it's like, okay, yeah, it's cool that Fee and Sarah and like Kurt dual wield, but it's like, well, that's just like they're using the same weapon twice usually. It's like, okay, I guess it just increases DPS. Where this is like, no, there's a purpose as to why he has to dual wield. It's because it's actually like one, it's like a combo weapon. Okay, so. Your strength is already boosted, so you're not gonna, the branch wouldn't actually do all that much. Um, yeah, so. Let's back you. Got you! Back you there. How shall we play? Okay, you can't do anything. Ready, bear. Alright, a week for two turns. Uh, you, you only have strength to move up for one more. So, let's have you Nadia special for a 200 CP boost. Um, you know, let's also blue gain, right? Because he's broken, so this is going to be the big damage, and chances are after, if this doesn't kill him, he's going to brandish. Or get boosted, or get enhanced, or whatever it is. Yeah, and he's going to survive. But I'm also benefited by the fact that Shadow Step is active, so the delay isn't going to be too bad afterwards. Um, okay, so let's let's get Mark. Target locked. You're down. You're up. Good. Hell of resurrection. You just heal yourself? No, didn't. I don't think you can heal yourself. Um. Okay. Let's keep everyone on the up and up with strength and move ups. Okay, so that's a guaranteed crit. So that's good. Okay, another one of those. Good. Keep the shit out of them. Okay. Okay, arts. Okay, flare butterfly. Ooh, venom flame you can get out beforehand. Um, strength. Do you have anything? No, you don't have anything that would. Venom flame. It's all C plus. And the first one would be A plus. Yeah, let's just. All right. Let's boost crit and oh CP. Yeah, because we want as many of these as possible. Uh, zoom zone. Uh, let's keep going. Nope. My turn. Okay. Probably should have done burst. Okay, you are totally healing, which is kind of bullshit. Um, okay, this will crit, so let's. Let's do that. Boost the strength. How shall we play? Okay, hundred. Ready. Let's do a uh, I shall. Good. My hair. Yeah. Breath, that should be a good you heal. Deserve yeah. some praise. Ready? Basically full heal. Okay. Then we will... Uh, 
Cast time minus. We'll do that. Cast time minus 70 for 8 turns. Because. I think we're getting to the point of. Uh, but just not being enough. Uh, stop you. My turn. Critting. Diamond Nova. Initiating process. Thanks. Releasing output limiter. I shall. Let's. Here it goes. It's me. Yeah, three ones. Roll cannon. Okay. Solar. Diamond Nova. Okay, this should do. It. Cast time. Cast time going down so much is really good. Charge. Okay, good. I was like, if that didn't kill it, I'd have S crafts available now. So it's not getting another turn to attack. No, your dress is fine. Right, but it is fine. Nothing, nothing got ripped too bad. Shire Breach level 7. Aerial Dust. EP through Attack and Craft. Good. Crit Rate up. Good. Good, good. Talisman level 7. Ivy Nail. Abnormal Status. 94% chance. 5% EP every turn. Or 5 EP every turn. That's not all that much EP, though. You use a lot of EP. Even perfection can stand to improve. Not much of a surprise. Hmm. <laughs> the cherry on top. There we go. So my question is, when is the C group going to get their chunk of the mirror so they can go to Reverie? Or Reverie Corridor? Because obviously all the teams are going to go there and each of the mirrors is like one third of the full mirror. But I'm just curious, it's like, when are, when are these guys going to get to go? Uh, looks like we managed to beat it. It's got the jump on me at first, but so long as we hit it, we can hit it, I can quit it. It wasn't terribly strong, not compared to the Thorns people. No, no stronger than most you are ever likely to face. Well, the Thorns people. <laughs> no, the Thorns people, yeah. Well, our way is open. Is it? This looks like a dead end to me. I might have a secret opening. I'll have to take a look around. On it. <laughs> the Thorns people. Uh, that's fine. I probably should buy boosts for this group. Eh. Let's get some money. Yeah, Cause the thing is, this group doesn't really, like, one, they're not fully accessoried out, which is one thing. Two, what they do have is not um, too crazy. Yeah, let's buy a few more of that. Um, battle scopes, buy three more of those. Want to have ten on. Times. Um, five of those, five, five of those, five of those. Make a seal is bad. Use bad. Yeah, okay, should be fine. And a few trade bombs. Okay, good. Ports, modify slots. I could. They all have one, at least upgraded. See, one. Once I do get like all the groups into Reverie, right? I feel like it'll be easier for me to figure out. Okay, who do I want to upgrade the slots for? Because it, like, I imagine that the best way to do it would not be to put all your eggs in one basket. But there's a part of me that's like, well, if I could just upgrade all of C's group, like fully get them done it's like okay that's one entire group that i don't even have to worry about but it probably would not be the smart way to go about it because as this group is there's only one caster so that's the only one benefiting from the ep increases although most of the time what you're doing when you're like i'd say cold steel beyond well, Cold Steel 1 and up, it's like, it doesn't really matter for casting purposes. It's more for all the other bonus things. It's like, oh, yeah, you want a stronger one for your stronger passives. Whereas, like, anything pre-Cold Steel 1, it's like, yeah, no, you, you want to do it on the caster first. Because they're the ones who need to have more lines open and better things so they can get better spells.
And here's the cemetery. I wasn't expecting to end up in a place like this. I mean, see, specifically said cemetery. Did we lose them? I know I've lost the strength to walk. Hmm? Not another step, C. Yo! That's, that's other C's voice. Crow armbrust with his twin guns. Damn, Crow so it's, so it's not Crow under there. Shit. Figured you'd know who I am. You took my old alias. Indeed I do. Though I had thought the unrest in Jirai would keep you occupied for longer than it apparently did. It's dicey over there. It's nothing Stark can't handle for now. Yo, Stark. You can't beat knowing friends have got your back when shit hits the fan. <laughs> you feel me? I assume you knew we'd show up? Who is he? This wasn't in the plan. One wrong coincidence, and we might have delivered you to him instead. We only ruled him out because he hasn't gone by sea since the Civil War. So, are you here to stake your claim on the letter? Or are you seeking compensation for the damages I've dealt under its use? <laughs> did, you, did you copyright C? Are you kidding? I could die of shame thinking of all the stunts I pulled back then. Even seeing your mask, I get the sudden urge. Smash it to pieces! Yo? Hey. Really? But my mask is so much more tasteful. <laughs> you think you can pull it off now. But trust me, you're gonna look back and wish you never did. I'll take your words to heart. <laughs> Yo, he's using his, his, uh, his double blades, I like it. And pull out his guns. Cool. It's 4v1, bro. Stand down. No point. I bought all the time I was looking for. Really? That was enough for them to catch up? Why are you here? I knew you weren't that C. We tarried far too long, it would seem. We'll catch up later. Let's take this crew down first. Oh, yeah? Are we doing another fight? You really? Okay. But this, this one's and against Reen and Crow. Okay. Mm -hmm. And the other two Thank that we didn't get to fight before. You had okay. best be prepared. You would best be prepared. Reduce past 7 HP to a certain amount. Okay, guess what we're doing immediately. We are popping this. Because we need to... <laughs> we need to battle scope them all immediately. Now, graduate of Thor's Class 7, he is known as the Ashen Chevalier and has mastered the 8 Leaves 1 Blade style. Uh, oh, they even have like a counter. Okay, crit. Uh, I should, should probably. It's a lot. Uh, probably shouldn't waste a crit turn like this. Um. Yeah, yeah do blue gain, right? Yeah, it's, better, it's, better, it's better than no damage. Row. Uh, members so of Thor's Class 7 uh, should be capitalized H. He is known as the Azure Chevalier and act as the original C two years ago. It's me! Uh, ooh, interesting. So there are people that are weak to fire? Oh, you're weak to fire. Fire Butterfly. Cool. Zooms on you. Ready? And then I can target lost. Mark all of this. Good. My so turn. you're poisoned. Emerald eye. Graduate Thor's class seven, the acting ruler of the Kreutzen province. He cuts down foes via arts and court fencing with How shall we play? That I did what I did. Um, okay. So let's battle scope the last one that I have yet to look at. 
Graduated Class 7, who is also known as the White Rabbit, she nimbly flies around the battlefield using her combat shell, Aragel. I shall. Initiating process. That's fine. Releasing output limiter. That. My turn. It's actually a shadow step. I shall. <laughs> And you're going up. Circle cannon. It's gonna do nice bit of damage. Uh, this for the nice no boost of crit. So that's gonna crit. Go. And then we're gonna have some fun. Right, so strength three full up boosted. Good. Okay, take Green out of there. Tough. Don't want him brandishing. You're Same with Crow. They're well. the ones that I do not want doing stuff. Um, okay. So now... Let's boost our crit. My turn! Good. Too late! It's me! Okay. Then. You can do it. Again. I'll take care of it. Now you special. Welcome to my tech detox. Take out Usus, because he'll go down. Million, also. Whoa, whoa, good. Time out! <laughs> good. Why is this so. This is so. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That wasn't. That wasn't bad. <laughs> Not bad. What kind of loser gets beaten by their copycat? Hey, I ain't lost yet. Re, let's take it up a notch. Got it. <laughs> let's both just Hulk out. Do what you can, class <laughs> God damn it. I'll show you how devastating. Oh that wait, can no. Be. Oh god, we're fighting ass. Like okay. I like okay. this where it's back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, over like multiple times. Use all enemies HP to a certain amount. Okay, can I swap? Yo, I can. Interesting. Okay, I'll probably swap out uh, at least then for uh, him. Um, in the pageant, where chaos storm HP P damage plus sixty for four turns. Jesus, that's good. Um, okay, plus 50 evasion. Okay. Well, uh, any of that give 30 damage. Okay, and that's three, so let's give everyone uh, the way. Noble strength on. boost. Uh, oh, goddamn, I got it. Look at him again. Yeah. Okay, an Angmax Soul, who is the most likely suspect in kidnapping of the Royal Couple, they goad their enemies with elegant sword sure. blood. Um, I'm down to rage. Um, yeah, let's do that. Uh, I'll fight. Um, nope, swap out. Would you mind? Pro. Watch and learn. Where are you at? Chronos Bullet. Use faint. Quick burst two, impede L, criminal edge, delay, eye of Balor, yep, Azure Destiny, yep, love it. Um could also do this. Um Okay, so let's just gonna do that. Okay, I'll no, hold it. I'll scope lapis. Nice. Dang girl who branches an axe thrice or says the joints on her limb suggest she is not human. Galleon for oh god damn it. So they can also use the Damn it My turn. Okay. Um Craft. Let's just heal up, make sure we're not getting bodied. 
Good. Let's go. Now let's go. Swim. Boy, going to use a pair of string swords. Mode change. Press R3 to change Crow's mode during battle. Use whichever is most effective. Saber mode slash and thrust has increased attack, defense, and reduced delay. Effective against strong enemies. Gunner. Weapon type pierce. Regular attacks can become ranged and hit multiple enemies. Uh, area effect for crafts also slightly. Yeah. Okay. Time to show off. Uh, I still have to ask the Nadia. Cute girl with a teddy in hand, though often underestimated at first. Her arts and needles prove her a force to be reckoned. Not on my watch! <laughs> I'll save you! Hey, I'm up! Good deal. So now let's do Chaos Storm for big damage. Wreak havoc! Chaos Storm! Because what I'm going it's to my do turn. is I am going to S craft with Reem. My and mind then is clear. S craft with my blade empty. Uh, now Ash. And S craft with Reem to make sure he hits to proc the guard break. And then uh, Ash, Bone Blade boosted, Strength boosted, Ash Chaos Christ. Storm boosted. Will do monster damage, hopefully. No. Good. Come on, let's Ellie have ourselves two. a two. And they're all broken as well for Very the boost broken. that happens. And also his master cords are set to do more damage against broken enemies. So yeah. This could be trouble. So he was all set to just do massive, massive Focus. stuff. Oh no. You're staying here. Uh-huh. It's not easy being outnumbered two to one. Gotcha. Not three to two. Shooting my shot. Shooting my shot. You're finished. Oh no, you slashed the mask. <laughs> Pull the hood down more. A pity. I didn't expect my cover to be blown quite this quickly. <laughs> what? <Well>, okay. <laughs> that voice. Knew it. Hmm? Yeah, it's Rufus. I remember seeing some fan art. You've grown, of... Rufus. As have your friends. I remember seeing fan art of Rufus, Rufus around it's when Rufus. Reverie came well, out or was like selling stuff. So it's like this isn't surprising, it's surprising. Crossbell. But I, so there's some bullshit going How on is this here. Possible. And also he, he looks good with short hair. What is Crossbell's new supreme leader doing here? I'm more surprised that it's so early that his mask you gets seem taken to be off. Confusing me with someone else. That title is not mine. That makes no sense. <laughs> then you had best get to making sense of it. I have my own affairs to attend to. Ah, impeccable timing. Best one. Yeah, no, two rooms. Yeah, so there's a. We're off. So there's a super evil one out in Crossbell right now, <gasps> and I guess what? Rufus, who may or may just pick up Lavis, <laughs> who I don't know what his deal what do you is. Think you're Yeah, this is like the money cutscenes. <laughs> Wait! No. We had an airship waiting for them. Yes, they did. That far ahead. He does. There's something we have to know, Rufus. Did you steal the Courageous too? Did you abduct Prince Oliver and Lady Sherizard? Was that really you? Yeah. It was not. Oh. Damn. I had no involvement in that incident, but it made for some fine bait. Oh, okay. Hate. <laughs> but... Then where could they be? If you wish to know what befell the Courageous Two, make for the Nord Highlands. Of course. Why there? With that, I bid you farewell. Should we meet again, <laughs> let it be in Crossbell. Okay, so next chapter is C going to be interacting with the SSS more. Okay. I'm surprised that they unmet like i'm not surprised sinking in uh, slinking in muck and mire reen and rufus root act two and okay See, i'm not surprised that rufus was c 
because like that was already kind of I don't want to say spoiled for me. Falcom spoils it for themselves, like in a whole bunch of, I think it's on like the anniversary shirt or whatever, where it's like all the main characters from like East and Trails. Rufus is on that shirt and you're like, wait, why is Rufus on that shirt? And it's like, oh, that's why. <laughs> and now instead of C, it's Rufus. Um, I'm more surprised that... Um, they don't hold it out for longer, right? This is only act two of what I presume is like three or four acts in the game. I, pr I would presume four, potentially even five, maybe like an epilogue act. Um, I'm, I'm more surprised that they don't hold it out for longer. Um, like I, I am almost actually surprised that they don't, have like some interaction between C and Rufus in Crossbell, and it's that Rufus that unmasks him, being like, Hey, what's up, dude? What's going on? But Rufus with short hair does look good. I like that. But it also brings the question who the fuck is Rufus in Crossbell right now? Like, who who is that? Um, but okay. So, I, okay, so I guess what's going to happen is, like, after... So this is, this is where it chunks off to be Act 3. Okay. Um, okay. Well, time to go investigate the ancient battlefield. <laughs> Play through Lloyd's route. Yes. Yes, let's go investigate the ancient battlefield. Oh, yeah. Hmm? Weren't we just... Oh, a few screws loose, or something feel off. Yes, it's like I just spaced out. Yeah, it's as if... Something does not up. It's like my body suddenly feels different. I feel... Stronger? How is that possible? There must be more to this mirror than meets the eye. More than meets the eye. <laughs> Made that joke when Reen said the exact same thing. Is everything alright, Lloyd? Is something on your mind? No, it's nothing. Nothing important, anyway. More concerned about what we're going to find at the ancient battlefield. Let's go. Man's got a point. Yes, we should get anything we may need from the village while we have the chance. Uh, you can view the status of characters from Reen's story in the party menu. You'll also be able to view characters from Lloyd's story while playing Reen's story. This allows you to check and move equipment across stories in addition to changing your party in the current story. You can also view, use L2 to view the party you are using for the every corridor. Finally, the characters you acquire by using gold ceiling stones will not directly join your teams in the real world. However, they can support you in battle by using orders. <laughs> Bro, use this. Um, okay. So let's put her there because why not? Um, okay. Your evasion is doing pretty good. Um, right, but I swapped. Whip, ports. Okay, I put something on someone. Right, that increased evade. Didn't I? Or was it something I wanted to put on someone? No, it was rage. I got rage. That's what I got. I got. I got. I got that rage. Got that rage inside me. Inside me, there are two wolves. <laughs> um, okay, so I got rage, which increases evade by ten percent and boosts accuracy, which would make it a lot better. Um, so let's swap breakout for that. So I am losing some attack and break damage, but I would rather have her set up more for good evade. Because right now, that's what I kind of have her built as. Um, okay, in your pixie, EP through offensive arts, but I'm almost tempted to swap her to... Like, I want to get this to level 7. I think because then I can make a fair comparison, but Kate Sith has it it's the same, it's just less as a percentage, and it has chance to absorb magic attacks and deal crit, like it's a combo it's a pretty darn good combo at that um Cavalier Nakumo question is, other characters how do I want to keep them? right? So I think Brave is a good one for him Murakumo. And also, I'm still... Oh, this part only has four people. 
So if I spread out the XP, then that's... That's... XP is spread out. Versus... Other ones, like Reen's group, where he has a lot more people right now. I'm going near. Dam increases damage dealt by criticals, which would be nice. Crit damage up. Defensive bar steel crit. DMS that. Okay. Um, Virgo. Offensive art steel crit. Absorb. Hmm. Yeah, I guess that's fine. Okay, we have evade one. Evade two is on someone. Um. You know what, you don't need evade. I'd rather you have speed and more move, and also a good heal. Right, because Pixie doesn't have... Eh, Pixie does give breath. But, not many other things that I could swap there. I could give holy breath. But then I lose the speed and move boost. Uh, I don't think it could be Rufus, because how could there be two Rufus? I mean, that, that is a really, that, like, if I didn't kind of already know which is unfortunate that, like, I think that's my main issue with Falcom, <laughs> right? Where it's like, because they're focused more on the Japanese market, it's like, okay, we can have merch that spoils who it is, or at least afterwards, a while ago. Like, the the like the like anniversary shirts. It's on, like, Arubis is on it. And it's like, he wouldn't be on it <laughs> if he wasn't. <laughs> and also, like, they, they do, like, they basically reveal it themselves. Um... And it's like, God damn it. Really? Did you did you need to? You couldn't have held it a little bit? Ooh. Ooh. Can you see up? I think so. Now let's I'm curious now. Let's let's check it out. Um Falcom anniversary shirt. Um images. Uh, no, no, not Falcon. Falcom. Falcom. Um, let me zoom in. And I say Europe. Zoom in, goddammit. Eh. Uh, yes, it is in his sea outfit, and he is holding Lapis. Like, he is holding her. <laughs> so like that like if it wasn't just his outfit giveaway it is also the additional character um so it's like god damn it did you guys really have to well, that's a bit of a spoil exactly and it's like i look i remember i was, I was looking at the shirt because i'm like oh that's a cool shirt and i'm like oh wait <laughs> fuck and i'm like god damn it guys and like by the time that shirt came out in japan Reverie was already out for a bit. So it's like, okay, anyone who was buying that shirt probably already played the game. And it's like, okay, it makes sense for the Japanese market, but for the West who didn't get it yet, well, it sucks to be you. <laughs> um, and I think that I think that's like the 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 main takeaway. Um, but yeah, it's uh I remember when I, I remember when I saw, I was like, God damn it. So then it was more of an interest of like other things where it's like, okay, when's he going to get revealed? How is it going to get revealed? I was not expecting Rufus to be a villain as well. Um, like I, I was not expecting him to be here. Dragon Rage, I might automatically um, analyze this thing. Actually, Confuse, uh, Confuse is fine. You don't need Galleon for it though. So I'll give you that. Uh, yeah, it's like I'm 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 still excited. I'm still excited to play the game. Like like all things considered, while it is probably one of the bigger spoilers, right? Of like, oh, who is it? Now that it's understood that it's this early in the game that it is given to you, right? Like, I'm not I like I'm what, twenty hours in? But yeah, I'm twenty hours in, but also I'm streaming, so it takes longer for me to do literally anything. Um Right. It's like to me, it's not that big of a surprise, right? right? If it were held out for a lot longer, being like, "Oh, who is it? Who is it?" Like, 
Like if it were the main, if it like, let's say it were the the biggest spoiler. Maybe like let's say it was the biggest mystery the entire game. Right? Like that would be one thing. Like oh hey here is like the thing that we show you in the last cutscene of the game or something or like it's the climax of the game. Right? Like that that would be one thing. But the way that the game is structured it's like okay you know what uh home home galol um but like yeah the way the game is structured it's like it's not that big of a deal that it's told to you all things good because you you you, you know it before the end of act two chapter two of however many chapters that, that that's the big question i don't know how long the game the main story of the game is all right like if the next act is the last act, okay, then that kind of sucks, shot. but I strongly doubt it. I already told you, Crow is C. Damn, so soon. Yeah, they took, dude, Crow, so much C. You know, he really had an internal struggle fighting against himself. It was it truly, truly, it, 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 it was a surprise to all involved. Okay. Let's go. I've got you. All right. Okay. How are you doing today, sleeper? Fire. Hope you're doing well. Why not? I won't let you! Death awaits you! Come! Perfect! It's mine! Right! Okay. Raise your camera. Let's go! Hope you're doing well. Hope we're all ready for a nice week. Because this week hasn't been. I don't think it felt long. Of course you can. But anything it, for you. I just wanted to play more of this game, and every day that I was not able to play more of this game, I was lamenting it. Um, I think I think that's just how it goes. Uh, one nice thing about playing games on release is no boring spoilers for you. I mean that it, yeah. yes. Easy victory. But also, hey man, like, well, I've waited for the official release for all the other games, Perfect. so might as well wait for it on Reverie like as well. <laughs> Because I would have had to, like, to get the, like, no to get the full, us. like, to get the full enjoyment out of this game, you need to have played Crossbow, which means I would have needed to get the Geo front of the two Crossbow games. But at that point, it's like, well, might as well wait till they get actually, like, officially released in the West. And then it's like, okay, fine. But yeah, like, it's why I'm really careful with anything Kuro related right now. Yeah, right? Because that. it's, oh, like, we'll Kuro is day. out. And I like I know all like the party members. I don't know like all their names. Like they're not like I, like I've seen them, right? There. right? And right I know stuff tower. about them and maybe like a thing or two that happens, potentially. But I don't know all that much. I am still pretty on. blind on it, and I plan to keep it that way. Like I do not want to know. I was blamed for creating monsters like me who derive and from playing unlocalized games first to hold it over people's heads. <laughs> I mean, hey man, Let's maybe go. once I one once I've gotten to the point that I can read Japanese better, uh, maybe I can I start you. playing uh, unlocalized games just like you. Right uh, let's do that. More CP. It's my turn. Because I mean, like, like as someone learning oh, a language, that is kind of the goal. Especially with Japanese, where it's like, I would like to be able to just watch an anime or play a game and not need to wait for it to be localized or subtitles. Just wait for your translation, it's all good. Yeah. Like, I think that that is my, like, ideal. I want to get to that point. Uh, I just fucked it over Sanctuary translation now. I mean, yeah. I think that's not? the main issue, right? Where it's like... Like, they really were building so much goodwill with, like, the way they handled, kind of like, okay, we get the Geofront for Azure and Zero, and then it's like, okay, cool. But then, like, it's like, oh, hey, stop doing, stop doing your fan translation, which I'm like, I don't even know how, how that would even work, right? It's like, it's like, we're, like, what, what legal grounds does that even have, right? I'm asking this in like a in a quasi serious fashion where I'm like I don't really get it. Where it's like if someone is going through a game, why would why are they legally not allowed to translate it if they know the language? 
and share what they're doing. Like, if they're not selling the... If they're not selling it, then I, I don't think there is any legal thing, but I think it's more just like, eh, we don't want to risk there actually being one, which is why they presumably stopped. But, like, I, I, like yeah, I mean, that's... That's my man. Let's go. Copyright and picture something. Exactly. Like, I, I, don't, I don't exactly get how that is a legitimate thing, because it's like... It's like, one, if they're not, like... I, I just said, it's like, if they're not selling it, and... Because also you have to think that it's like, well, so long as the game is already also being purchased legally, then to Falcom it doesn't matter. It would only be to NISA. Because they're the only ones at risk. Of course. But, yeah, yeah. whatever. <laughs> but yeah, it is really just an unfortunate to. thing of like, oh yeah, they built up like a lot of goodwill and then kind of like immediately took it away because it's like, hey, we we'll work with Geofront to get it out, but we don't want another Geofront situation. <laughs> I've done it. Yes, I'm moving up. To which I'm like, well, wh why wouldn't you want that situation? They're like, yeah, it's a lot of work to like probably annoying to like get that word. done. It probably creates like a lot of like annoyance and like I'm like, okay, like how much is like the community gonna like be like, oh, that's not what the fan translation said for X Y Z versus <gasps> like what the official now. translation puts for it. But at the end of the day, it's like, okay, well, how much did it cost? Like, how much did they essentially purchase the translator for? What was the money value? And would they spend more money translating it from scratch themselves or buying it from them and then just checking it, right? Like, if it were to happen again. Um, or is it trying to avoid the potential um, legal issues of, like, let's say... They didn't want to buy it, but then, like, oh, hey, their translation looks very similar to the fan one. Oh, hey, was, did, did they, in not good faith, look at the fan translation and use that to make their process go faster? And maybe by stopping it, they just avoid that conversation entirely. But it's not my job. It's out of my pay grade. Not my concern. I'll just wait for the games to come, and I won't get spoiled on them. Uh, but I got this game to play because I have no idea what's going to go on. Ancient Battlefield. It's been a while since I last needed to come here. If I remember correctly, the Imperial Army had a camp set up here until recently. That's right. It was taken down when they withdrew from Crossbell. I sent something menacing farther inside. It isn't just the monsters roaming around. Thought I felt someone when we passed here earlier. Good to know the old instincts haven't lost their touch. Yeah, we need to be alert. Everyone proceed with caution. Let's look out for one another. Of course. Right. Okay, time for the ancient battlefield. I remember this place. Uh, hey, can you, like, turn of course. around, please? Cool. Don't know what you guys are. Now! This. Good to go. Uh, four of the vermilion damage insight for six chains. Like that. There we go. I don't mind. CP. Battle scope. Do not yeah. use the shining bomb incense. A thick skinned monster prowling the nooks of interdimensional space that can swallow prey larger than itself without an issue. Salomon Dragon. It's my turn. It's the Salomon Dragon. Ah. All right. Okay. Faint. Right. Yeah. I've got you. Get it's it back over. Easy, so. Thanks, Sally. I know I can always count on you. <laughs> of course you can. Anything for you. Okay, so Pixie's getting good. The other one's not getting all that much, but it's almost at level seven, so I'm not too concerned about it. Um, okay. So once again we have Ancient Battlefield underground path, and then yeah. So I'm gonna presumably have to go to the right, but let's here. 
<laughs> Wait, did that say feathered guest? Yeah. Feathered guest. Okay. Item battle scope. Yeah. Large seabird moss that nests in human silence, despite its namesake, it is sound consensually made welcome into people's homes. Leave it to me. Despite being called a guest, it is rarely ever a guest. Although I like how they say seldom. Like, like it's not never. It's just Thanks, only sometimes. I know I can always count on you. <laughs> only sometimes we invite them over. Power droplet. Oh, who knew we'd get so lucky? At some point, I'll use well, these. Well, this thing's not opening. That's fine. There's a hidden passage in through the bell tower above. Ah, oh, I remember the one. Hopefully, it's still open. I hope you remember the one. It's not like, not like anything really should have happened to change that. Yeah. Um, member of ancient tribe, once mercilessly oppressed, seeks to restore his tribe's former glory through indiscriminate bloodshed. It's my turn. That's how. That's how. You, that's how you restore glory. Indiscriminate bloodshed. It's my turn. As you do. Arcs, Nemesis Arrow. Arcus Act of course. If I'm okay. to protect oh, what matters most to me, then I can't lose. Ooh, battle scope times three. Nice. Everything I used there I got back. There we go. There it's going. Excuse me. God, it's such a good move. Why not? Like my god. Right. Leave it to me. Right there. It's my turn. Ixie Volt. Yeah. Let's check out this. I haven't seen Ixie and Volt, I think. Or at least I haven't seen one of my characters use it. Because I think Rufus in the crossbow fight might have used it. Nice. Got such a meaty sound with the break. Sorry, but we need to press on. The break sound is so meaty. Virgo, nice blue ascension. We like that offensive our steel crit. We reduced AT delay after water arts. We'll take that. Then I'll take that every day of the week and twice on 18 over 42 day. 96 Kingdom Hearts. Uh, uh, hike. Magic droplet. That one's remarkable. Hmm. It brings my ATS up one. So remarkable. Damn it. <laughs> Once again, me trying to right me trying to kinda like whirl around the uh the things isn't working. Alright. Nemesis arrow. Arc is activated. I'm going. Come now. It's mine. Good to go. Oh boy. Why not? Oh, you don't keep the spell going? Okay, Ragnar. That's going. Yeah! Menagerie of ghostly grudges left behind in a massive battle. Foes delve into madness if punctured by its claws. Of course. Okay, well, let's do. Uh, you know, let's do up. this for more damage. Death awaits you. Come uh, now. Good. It's mine. Right. Yeah, you got death blow. We'd love to see that. All right. Uh, no, unfortunately, nothing. Uh, mind. For you, soul blur. Yeah. This is perfect. Good. Don't give Thanks. in. Please. Good to go. Yeah. Of course. Perfect. Good. Mine. There are more coming. Come. Now. Mine. Why not? Okay. Actually, you know, I haven't done that. Oh, a little fast. Attack! It's over. Leave it to me. Now's the time. Um, there. You're finished. Damn. Get bodied. Thanks, Ellie. Three point oh. No, it is real. It's honestly not <laughs> difficult to get a three. Of course you can. Three time Anything modifier. Three it's nice. really just get into a three it. chain, and you're pretty darn good. Tiger charge cannot be used. One impede hundred. Balance down hundred for one turn. Oh, that's really good. So it's like, hey, if you really want a BP, but also attack, this is your ticket. Just another day for free stuff. Just uh, ingenuity, ATS, HP graduate, or EP graduate recovers while walking. Do I already have that on Ellie? Because I got it in a chest. Yeah. Um, okay, so that'll be good on one of the other casters. 
So instead of Silverthorn, let's put Ingenuity on you. Yeah, because that increases your ATS and you get it back. So. <laughs> I got the sound effect just goes perpetually until the thing actually comes back. Like, it, re it really cares. It's like, hey, until it comes back, we'll keep playing the sound just in case. Here's our shot. Okay. Keep it up. Let's do this. Still soul blur on you. Blue ascension. Come you out of there. The blade smash. I don't mind. Good. Okay. You are hard sealed. All right. Arc is active, of course. Yeah. Let's go. Why not? Sure, gotcha. Attempt. Okay. Sorry, but we need to press yeah, on. Oh, no, isn't bad. I need to keep at it. Okay, probably chest down here. There's also good to fight. In the other games, there's a, uh, there's a chest back there, and there's a fishing spot right there. I think in zero. I wonder who would put that chest there. Heal HP gradually and gives tier tier all and curia. That's actually quartz. Tier tier all and curia. Ooh, see that's actually pretty worth it. Cause that there's Thalus and that gives Athelus. That's restore HP L. Um, no, instead of boosting your thing, let's give you, mm, tier. You know, if you already have tier on you, right, I'm going to say that that's, well, one, I could change it. I could probably swap it out with something a bit better for him and how I want him to kind of do stuff. But, you know what? Him having it isn't bad. Because at least he has more options. Um, hit one. Do not have a hit two. Need. I don't want to get rid of anything that boosts accuracy. So, yeah, you know what, this, Cross Crusader, yeah, I'll just put Shining SR, um, that's just good. Put Shining SR on him because that increases his accuracy and increases his other stuff, so it's just better all around. Okay. Excuse me. Right, let's right do this. Just cause I have no idea what the gold giant is weak to, but all I know is now. that I let's want to do a lot right of it. Let's burst. Got it. Leave it Copy to me. Never heard yeah. of any bursts in Fire. this game. Good to go. Good. Okay. So let's battle scope. Yeah. Figure out what the gold giant is all about. Uh, okay, a tyrant with shimmering golden skin and a radiant, powerful fist. This king among demons crushes all who dare challenge the throne. But you can be slept, nightmared. Don't like water. Don't. Let's like go. Another one. He bounced down. Our increase is to that. It's my turn. Let's do this. Yeah. No. That way I can also get Rishia hitting him. Yeah, for the chance of nightmare. It's my turn. Um, you know what? I'll do that so she can. Yeah, just keep yeah. keep yeah, having Rishia hit. I don't mind. Because it's just better, I think. It's down. 
More chance of getting status ailment on. Okay, raging hammer. It's my turn. They're open. I've got you. And of course. Yeah. It's my turn. Uh, oh, ascension. Uh, Why not? Eden. Okay, let's order. Actually, let's do this. Here's the advance. Behold my. Come on, Stasa. Yeah, you can use some great. You vile. Blue ascension should kill it. No, okay, right. I didn't kill it. That's fine. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, but we got stuff to do. Okay, Pixie level seven, so let's see what this does. Curia, that's good. 0.25%. That's not bad. AT delay after wind arts. I've done it! Um I mean I guess that could be Divine Crusade, weak for two turns, nice. Get done, move. Okay, so they definitely moved uh they definitely made weak a better status or well, they I'm not better fight. status ailment, but they made it le they made it less uh well they actually implemented it on more characters is the thing that I keep failing to say miserably. Use our shot. Uh, they can Arcus activate. Uh, I guess it just for whatever reason those words just did not want to come out. Probably. Why not? Down. Attack. Right. Go burn poison nightmare faint. There we go. Sorry, but we need to press on. Lethal assist auto charge three. An easy victory. Come now. This is it. I don't mind. And it's down. And let's burst. My... Whatever. Doesn't matter. Right. I got you. Leave it to me. Fire. Now's the time. There. Why not? It's down. It's easy enough. To get enough of it back. Man, the legendary part of the legendary Shang Show is underselling it. Strange, because Scarecrow oversells how scary you actually are. <laughs> get burned. Uh, you're not very scary, Lecter. Just another day for free stuff. Uh, chest green emblem. Uh, okay. Accuracy 50, evasion 5. That's good. So green emblem, similar to... This green emblem, sleep nightmare confuse. More accuracy, green pendulum, yeah. So getting those will be good, because those are things that I'm going to need to use to fuse upwards into the best versions of the stuff. So, might as well get them out of the way. And Fortune wow. shines upon us. That bell is, uh... This bell has been nerfed very hard from the Zero and Azure games. It is a lot smaller, not nearly as big. go. Save there. So can I even... Like, can you even go into the memory corridor? No, it's just not. Like, it seemed like it was like that one instance. Unless I'm like in the between paths or some other reason. Okay, now we have the fun good to fight. downward spiral. Doesn't seem to have nearly as many uh, off branches, or actually, no, wait, no. This is this is pretty, this is our chance. pretty similar. Come. Uh, no. Down here just leads to that place where we mind. can fish and get one specific bonus cutscene in uh, Azure. Let's go. Like, yeah. like that I didn't get on stream. It was only because I was uh, in the guide to get all the achievements. It was like, hey, we're here to get an extra thing. And I was like, oh, okay. Well, let's go get that extra thing. Legendary part of... <laughs> no reason not to. It's basically the entire idea behind this. 
Okay. Good to go. Zero arts. Down for it. There we go. It's my them. turn. I want them all taken out. It's my turn. Yeah, they're off guard. Good. Why not? It's down. Attack. Death awaits. Yeah. Right. All right. Ooh, petrified. That's what I like to see. Death awaits. Yeah. This is why we like petrified. That's that. And why I should probably look into seeing what I can put on people to get petrified. Let's not forget to open that chest. Earth bell. Good. 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 Because like. Nightmare and Petrify are two of the best <laughs> status ailments easily. This is our chance. They are just they are just that good. Um yeah. something like that. Come. Perfect. I'll do a rush. Let's go! Ah, no! I've got you! Leave it good. to me! Yeah, they're off guard! I'll do a rush. I need to get that count up as well. I don't mind. It's down! Attack! It's over! There. I'm going! Now! Mine. Right. Leave it to me! Yeah! Sorry, but we need Popped to press it. on. <laughs> Popped it from a while away. Just pew. Pew, pew, pew. Here's our shot! You know, oh yeah, I need to remember I have this, this as well. I always forget about it. Right there. Camera. Yeah. Uh. Ah, they're open. Good. I got you. It's, it's over. Death awaits you. Come. Now. Nice. Fine. Good to go. Zero arts. There you go. Have another art. That's that. Whatever. The next. Zero. I want to use it. Nice. I need to keep. Why wouldn't I do it? Um. Okay. There we go. You in there? Let's save for. Don't take that enemy lightly. Yeah, yeah. Everyone, remain yeah. vigilant. I want to get you first. Um, okay, so. Let's get the damage in. So, let's pop that. Perfect. I'll do Paris Lean Dance for a boost of damage. Not 200 CP. That's good. Good. Why not? And got him. Let's go. And Let's go. Sorry. Oh wow. We okay. Got stuff to do. <laughs> I was not expecting that. I've done it. You can proc a death blow or something. Wonder who would uh, put I think that I there. Cavalry Edge SR speed plus ten. Do I have Cavalry Edge on the side? Did not need to do that. Yeah, now. But I need to get a CP anyway, so right Good to go. Fun with it. It's my turn. Leave it to me. Yeah. I'm going. Yeah, now. Come on. It's mine. Good to go. It's my turn. Yeah. Leave it to Meyer. Of course. I don't mind. Gotcha. Turns. All right. Nice and quick. Of course. If I'm to protect what matters most to me, then you need to kill things even better. Cavalry edge. Um, the chrono breaker. I think I'm gonna cavalry edge on. Cavalry edge, I think, is only a move that people add on. For uh, yeah, they had it on for other stuff, or had it on because of other stuff. But crystal edge is one that's on. Hut, 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 hut. There we go. Uh, 
Let's take Arc that. Is activate. That. Because most of it is just big. Anyways, I got you. Why not? Great. Hammer. Good to go. It's down. Attempt. Don't give in. Hammer. All right. Now's the time. Of course. Break that. Death awaits you. Now. It's mine. Right. I don't mind. I'm going. It's my turn. Fire. Right. I don't mind. Of course. It's my turn. Let's get out of Sorry. But we got Love stuff it. to do. Level five. Rush. Okay. So I need to well, once, and that that's gonna be another thing. Like getting everyone's link levels like nice and high. I have to work around that. Probably maybe a bit be easier in Reverie Corridor where it's like, yeah, you're gonna be able to passively just get it up from combat across a lot more people. Right, whereas like right now it's like, okay, it's only going between the two mashed people and two sub people. Can I make sure? Are those bullet holes? They look pretty fresh. That's strange. I haven't heard about any fighting breaking out around here. Huh. It's got me curious too, but no point in playing detective right now. Let's keep moving. Okay. Come over here. Open this. I think the levers on the other side in uh in the other games. Yeah. All threats will be eliminated. Okay. Let's do right there. this. Right. And right. Okay, hammer again. Right. Horatius thing up. Heart. It's my turn. Ah, no. I've got Three. you. Leave it to me. The ascension. Arc is active. <laughs> got you for it on crit turn. That's pretty good. <laughs> Good to go. I have a thing. Yeah, actually. Keep it. A million. Why not? A little foot down. Attack. It's my turn. Ah, you're open. I've got you. Death awaits you. This, this squad is really good at keeping uh, like, CP up. Like, CP and BP up is like, this, this team, for whatever reason, is just really good at it. Like, I've set them up in such a way that they consistently are just sitting at max. Um, good. All those. Give me my ingredients. I haven't... Oh, it's right to go to Reverie. Okay, I was like, I kept trying to hit left to go here to that screen. Okay, but I don't believe I can go there with... Um, yeah, I don't think I can go there I'm with good to Rufus's fight. squad just yet. With C squad. I hope I, can the, I, hope I, I hope he puts the mask back on, because I do like it when his mask is on. Like, he looks really good. Let's not forget to open that chest. Uh, chrono break, delay plus eight. Um, that's good. Speed plus 12. Um, scent. Strength. That was chrono break you are. So let's take off attack one. Give her more delay. And then instead of impede, I'll put on anything that gives more strength. No, no. Um, attack one. I'll probably swap this and I'll kind of break you off. I feel like. 
What do we have? Yeah, he has Chrono Break SR. And that also gives delay 8. So you are an SR, seem to be basically identical in like those, but it's only in the stats that they get boosted slightly. Like right, like eight versus twelve, but the, the delay amount that it causes, even with Chrono Break, are always eight. But that's good because delay is a stat element that I like inflicting. It is one of my favorite. Okay, modify slots. You really have enough. But I don't want to. So let's rest. Okay. Um, could. I could, but, you know, I don't need to. Let's save. Save over that. And reach the end of the battlefield. We've been expecting you. Hello there. Is that... I suspected it was you. Is that Gaius slash Sal? Yes, it is. Sal Lee. Or Chow. Oh, sure. A pleasure as always, Yin. Uh I keep doing that. You prefer Risha. It's good to see you're both in good health as well, Detective Bannings and Miss McDowell. And if it isn't Major Arendelle, I trust you've been keeping well since we last met? Of course. I'm getting by. I've had my hands full since the last time we teamed up. So good to see you remember. You were a valuable asset indeed. I wish I could be as satisfied with the sad state Crossbell is in. Thank goodness Master Shin returned to the Republic just before all of this began. Thank goodness. Indeed. It was quite the stroke of good fortune. Hey, Yusus. Hey, I'm a little child. I'm thankful you contacted me, at least. Might I ask where Elia and Kia are? You needn't worry. They're in the fortress behind us. After all, we wouldn't want them being hurt now, would we? So, are you going to fight us and also why? <laughs> Mm. I think that's my main question. I wish I could say I didn't see this coming. You made your position so obvious by not appearing during the chaos at the signing ceremony. You're in Rufus's back pocket, aren't you? Oh, how little trust you have in me. Or you perhaps trusted exactly what I do. The Supreme Leader made contact mm. as we were considering okay. our Crossbell Branch's future under <laughs> renewed independence. Once the elders gave their blessing, we decided to take him up on his generous offer. Okay, so these guys aren't even under the effect of a curse or whatever the hell's going on. It's just like, oh yeah, no. You really are the worst. Yeah. Loyalty means nothing to them. They'll betray you in an instant if the price is right. What's more, given their formation and numbers, they knew exactly who among us would be coming. <laughs> Astute as ever, Yin. Yes, a kind-hearted informant told us exactly who we should expect, letting us be fully prepared. An informant? Don't tell me it was... No, it couldn't have been Lecter. There would have been no reason to stop the EDF from arresting us if he was working with Rufus, too. Hmm. Oh, Probably someone from the that's town. a fair point. Or whatever. <laughs> Are you sure you aren't just being too naive? But yeah... Pretty sure you wanted him to suspect me, didn't you, White Orchid Dragon? Well, let me just drop your title. My apologies <laughs> for the confusion. I simply thought it would be easier on you if you didn't know the truth. And what exactly is that supposed to mean? I'm starting to get it now. We haven't had contact with that many people since the ceremony. That basically narrows the informant down to someone in Armorica. Someone who knows us well enough to give him accurate information on what to expect. Wait. Who are you suggesting? Oh, is it Shan Shan? Risha. Yeah. <laughs> no. San San? San San? What's she doing here? Wait. It couldn't be. How'd she get here? How'd she get here before us? <laughs> That's my main question. I told him everything he wanted to know. That you and two SSS members came to the village with the red-haired man who'd been to our restaurant. 
What have you done to her? Is she under some kind of hypnosis? Uh, yeah, kinda. Curse stuff. Uh, please. I may be capable, but you should know that such things fall outside my area of expertise. All I did was lend an ear to a kind-hearted young woman who wanted what was best for her friend. <laughs> Lily's gonna have a fun surprise when he sees Seer. Oh yeah, he is. He's gonna be like, wait, 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 wait. What the fuck is going on here? <laughs> Why? What? What do you mean? How did you see? You cut your hair? But that one didn't cut his hair. But what? You wearing extensions or not extensions? <laughs> Let's oh, it's go gonna be... home, Risha. Oh, okay. The world will be a better place if we do what the Supreme Leader says. You won't have to do anything dangerous ever again. Wait. It can't be. San San. You're doing this because you're worried about me? Yes. Yes, she is. But also, can you not see the... I guess Rupa is on his Christmas card list. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, I guess not. It, does Christmas even exist in this world? If it does, does that not imply the existence of Falcom Christ? <laughs> um, yeah, so do they not see the, the curse goop, like, rising from the ground around her? She's giving off the same aura okay, that people good. at the signing ceremony were. Good, I'm glad they Must see it. gotten to her without her even realizing it. I guess it was dormant till something triggered it to make her loyal to the Supreme Leader. You've got to be kidding. That's possible? This power defies all logic. Yeah, it's like magic. Pardon the interruption, but I do believe you'll have time for speculation as you're being escorted back to the city. Lao. Certainly. Certainly. I'm afraid we must take all of you into custody. <laughs> I can I can really just hear Yusus just dropping his voice. <laughs> and that's all I can hear. Please try not to take it personally. <laughs> Stay on your toes. Each of them is skilled in Eastern martial arts. Hold on. This wasn't what we agreed. You said you wouldn't hurt them. <sighs> oh, damn, cool. Good to, good, good to know you can just finger you knock out someone. <laughs> Settle down. I merely rendered her unconscious for a short while. <laughs> We'll send her back to the city with you. So don't worry. You're an ass, so guys. Sorry, Sal. But we'll be leaving here under our own power. Let's do this, Risha. Of course. You won't have the time to regret what you've done. We'll back you up. For Kia and Ilya sakes too. And no one here will die, because we know no one's gonna die here. Forgive me, but we must. Ooh. Uh, okay, so let's Keep reduce strong. our damage. Toughness shield. Toughness shield. Okay, let's get uh, the Hayway yeah. members out of the way. Trained fighter of Hayway, his rigorous martial arts training has made him strong enough to barehandedly defeat armed soldiers. Gotcha. Body Vile. All right. Okay. Ixie. You know what? Yeah, you can start there at least. Uh, battle scope. Take out one and do the other one. Train fire of Haley is rigorous much like Shane. I'm trying to get. Right. That really take them out of the thing? Okay, gonna have to final scope. Yeah. Sash just retaining that never fails to be in tune with his master. He never talks, but his formidable fighting skills speak for themselves. Of course. So, uh, true Phoenix Claws. Come! <laughs> Get in. Why not? But up, fools the million. I don't mind. All for one and one for all. One for all. Unbelievable. 
I'm gonna Paris lean dance because I know there's a crit turn coming up, but Behold my dance. I don't think it's that big of a deal. Offering to departing so <laughs> Good. I fail. Take out the other two. And a lot of All right. Lows shenaniganry. You don't like water? That's pretty good for me. <laughs> Miss. Get body. Crit. And I'll burst. Because why the hell not? You're a tough one. Good to go. You're a tough one. Um, okay. Let's do... Let's do arts. All for one. And one. one for all. May our power gather. Yo, Rose, what's up, girl? Right. Okay. It's my turn. Arcus activate. Death awaits go. you. Yeah. Oh, here I go. Oh, yeah, that's that's what I want. So this Good. is the end. Sorry, but we need to press I, on. I got worried because I was like, oh, I want. I forgot that I wanted to kill him before he enhanced because they would heal himself. But uh, luckily. I did, nice. did enough damage to Blue I've done it. I need to keep at it. Guess I'm moving up. Yeah, because like, I feel like that's I feel like that's the name of the game with any boss past CS3, right? Or past CS2, I guess, where it's like CS3, 4, um, and Reverie, where it's like, hey, kill the boss before they enhance. Like, they're going to enhance at about halfway or like one third health, right? So get them to a point where you can just do all of it from half to the end in one go. Do not give them a chance to to enhance, because it's annoying. It's like CS2 bosses, yeah. where it's like they all have heals. I hope you didn't think I'd be soft on you simply because we've been allies before. Hand over Kia, Ilya, and Sansan, or we'll leave you no other choice. <laughs> What, you gonna kill him? Oh, Please do. How are we supposed to stop her? I suppose I should have known that even Lao wouldn't be able to defeat you now. My apologies, Master Sao. You're outnumbered, Sao. Give Kia back to us. You know this won't end well for you if you continue to resist. I'll admit that you make a convincing argument. But unfortunately, a few observers have arrived to make sure I honor our agreement. What? Well, looks like you're in deep shit. Oh, there's a Garcia. Yeah. God yeah. ah, damn it. Is that Garcia? What are you doing here? He has Kia with him. Ilya's there too. <sighs> Risha. Lloyd! Ellie! I messed up. Sorry that I got caught. We found Kia as she was helping evacuate people in the city. But who was going to rescue her? That was when we thought to take her and the nearby Elia under our wing. What? Hold on, Kia. We'll rescue you and escape here together. Don't worry. You've been really brave. Just hold on a little longer. <laughs> we'll take care of them. We're not going to kill anyone, but we'll take care of them. Okay. I am Garcia. Garcia Rossi. You're not the same police brat from a few years ago, eh, Lloyd Bannings? For a split second, I thought that was Guy at the ceremony. You've really come a long way. Wish I could say the same about you. All I can feel is disappointment. I honestly believed you'd atone for your sins and turned over a new leaf. Mm. Thought so too. But then I got offered as much turf as I wanted in this whole United Nation thing. Sounded like a nice way to get Ravach bet together. So it is Ravach. I agreed to knock these guys into shape as commander. 
Who'd pick three hots in a cart over a one-way ticket to freedom? <laughs> Gotta back the winning horse with its free mirror. Did you say your goal is to get Ravash back together? That's why you're doing this? But... Cut the crap! You honestly expect me to buy that, Garcia? You had your chance to escape when I was falsely imprisoned. You turned around and helped me. You told stories about my brother and gave me the perspective I needed. Yeah. You picked me up when I was at my lowest. Yeah, like there's no reason why we would expect him to get Ravash back together after not taking his chance to do exactly that earlier. Now you want me to believe that you would side with a dictator just to take the easy way out? Like hell you would. Lloyd, you're right. It makes no sense. Neither does Uncle mm. Dieter's choice to side with him. Yeah, so there's some bullshit going on because obviously, like, we know there are multiple versions of a person. Because, like, that dancer in Crossbow was obviously Ilya, but with, like, white hair. But Ilya's there. And Rufus is Rufus doing his Rufus y thing. Uh, while C is out there. So it's like, already, there, there has to be some bullshit with doubling. So it's probably like, oh, the dark desires or like the lost potential or whatever, like is the, the thing. Maybe, Maybe you haven't come as long away as I thought. Still sound wet behind the ears to me. Yeah. To grow up or get your ass off the battlefield. Yeah. So you are going to offer your support. We do make for strange bedfellows, don't we? God, I just want to kill Sal. <laughs> I'm just tired of how long this is taking. Helping you makes my skin crawl. But you'd best damn pull your weight, white orchid dragon. I wouldn't want to disappoint you, old friend. You always did make my heart dance with excitement as an enemy. I hope you'll do the same as an ally. Mm. <laughs> okay. Phase two of the boss fight. Great, a former regimental commander from Zephyr, and a master martial artist. Neither of them are to be taken lightly. Let's settle this, Sal. Good luck, guys. You can do this. We will. Just you watch. We'll be there to save you before you know it. Noise. See, it's like, wow, if Sal got involved with the fight before, Let's maybe they, maybe his side would have won without winning Shall for Garcia. We do battle? <clears throat> Be victorious within 40 turns. Okay, that's kind of annoying. I have to use two immediately to, um... Keep okay, so... Not going to be doing much status ailments on you guys. So... Let's get you immediately. Now it's the White Orc Dragon and the branch of the Crossbow Branch of Hayway. He's a powerful Eastern martial artist. <laughs> I don't mind. Eh, damn it. Okay, it's a real cannon. You don't like fire. You don't like fire either. So, <laughs> we'll do that. It's my turn. Oh, and it is full health as well. Okay. Um. Raging hammer. Right. Let's do an attack. All for one. And one for all. One for all. Leave There's it to me. That. The battle scope. Garcia. Form okay. Jaeger. Observer known by many as the Killing Bear. Use raw strength and tactical. I'm going. Uh, stuff. Also delay them, but I guess that's not too yeah. <laughs> It begins. All right. Okay. Here I go. Take this. Good. Now's the time. Okay. Rush. You need to take advantage. <laughs> this as much as possible. Hey Yorin. Hey Yorin. Hey Yorin. Ooh, you slept. <laughs> that's not good. <laughs> Is nothing. Stealth, strength, and speed. Yeah, let's do Moonlight that. butterflies. 
Better get ready. First attack. Uh, Let's go. Okay, blinded. Sun. It ends here. Let's go for it. Okay. Why not? So let's try and get you guys out. This is what I need to do. A lot of damage. Yes. This is nothing. Focus on him. It's my turn. Okay. Well, I want to. I should probably. Uh, thank you so much. Sealed blade. Thank Changrim. Four through. Okay. Didn't do anything. Is a cannon. Okay. Good. <laughs> You're not so he's a half. Play. Death awaits you. So now you're gonna whack. Now All right. Then you're gonna go down to her. Who? Pixie and Volt. 100, 120. But not fast enough. If I did. No, wouldn't be enough. Oh, you got your shit back. Got it. Okay. Then right. let's do this. It's my turn. Star HBL. Arcus activated. Thanks. Good. Good to go. Okay, so he's up. Death awaits you. Let's raging hammer. Of course. Void. Yeah. Death awaits you. For big damage, Behold my break, <laughs> and you're back. Even I'm getting Down. fired up. You're at 26. Oh, okay. That's not great. But, oh wait, should have watched it. You vile. Fuck. Damn it, Vector. Ooh, here. Vector didn't go down. Okay. Um. Aura rain. Starts 20% HP. Much. Full I don't HP. mind. Um, I don't <laughs> trust. Why enemy, not? So, let's do this. Oh, night. I wish they would be giving me more. I wish they would be giving me more. Let's go. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna be able to do it. Let's do this. That's cool move. This is it. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to do this in 40 turns. And it didn't unbalance, so that was a kind of Let worthless description. Oh, 
<laughs> I just gave him 10% HP. Yeah, yeah fuck. This one's gonna not hurt. survive. Get it. Out of my way. Uh, I don't mind. Yeah. Hey, yo. Ready? Wasn't even able to take one though. Hey, yo, Rin. More fruit! <laughs> Why not? Zero craft. Alright. Keep things <sighs> up. This. Mm. I'm going. Why not? Yeah. Of yeah, course. This seemed like a. Yeah, it's like an unrealistic goal <laughs> with the setup that I have. Um, Death awaits you. Oh, you need Parkus activate. This one, get it. Um. <laughs> Thanks. I don't mind. Like, I'm already at 60. Why like, not? Like, I, I think the main issue that I have with it is, hey, I'm trying to build up their break. Right? I tried to build up their break, and I did. But once they talk, they get their break back. They're unbroken. And it's like, okay, well, great. That thing that I just worked toward has been made redundant. Let's go. Okay. Let's just heal. I don't mind. Right. Good to go. I'm going. Come. Perfect. Let us hang <laughs> Stop spreading my, my people turn. out, but also, like, stop doing the things that you're doing. Arcus, activate! It ends here! Break him. <laughs> no, nope. took him out. Well done. This one's gonna hurt us. So Get out of my way! So I'm definitely not getting the reverie points. I can't lose here. Needed. Uh, I am more Arcus curious to know ah. if reverie points are able to I'm be going. grinded out to some degree. Because if they are, good. If they're not, Keep it up. sucks. Of course. Yeah. Yeah. This way, now. Good to go. Be <laughs> God, God damn. A bunch of saps. If I'm to protect what matters yeah, most to me, was, then I can't That lose. was terrible. Our right, Kuma reached level 8, though, so we'll take that. 42% chance, evasion plus 7. Nice! I've done it! I need to keep at it. Yes, I'm moving! Okay. It's not have to be a uh, new game plus get. If it even matters. Damn kids. <laughs> Splendid. Now's our chance! Risha! Ellie! <laughs> what are you? What do you think you're doing? <laughs> but yeah, really, really short side of Sao to not jump in with the rest of his group when they actually had a better chance. We did but it. Garcia and him did do better. Look! But like, still. <laughs> hey. Yeah. You're not hurt, right? <laughs> I guess I don't have anything to worry about if you have the energy to tackle me from behind like that. 
<laughs> yep, I'm fine. Thanks for coming to save me. No problem. <laughs> I never doubted for a second that we'd see each other again. <laughs> Neither did I. Ilya, are you all right? Rish? Huh? You came all the way here just for me? Seemed out of you it. You look like you're totally exhausted. Take it easy. We'll get you somewhere where you can recover. Huh? They're all right! Well, at least we finally managed to get things under control. No. Oh, he's smiling. The hell? Lector! Okay. Oop, money cussing. Risha, get away from her! <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> what a shame. I nearly had you, Risha. Those were terrific reflexes. You always do live up to my expectations. Okay. So this okay, so it's not I presume it's not actually two Ilias that <laughs> Her hair's gonna turn white, I presume. Ilya Yo, throwing out kicks. Uh -huh. Yo! Zeit! Huh? Zeit! Zeit barrier! Holy beast, sight! It's good to see you two again. Yes! I've come to resume my duties as your police dog. Yo, thanks, I. Yo! The wolf pack! What? What? W wolves? They're just a bunch of mangy beasts. If only it were the beasts. Hey, Wazzy! Yo, what it's the church friends. The Grawl Sritter. Not bad. Wasn't expecting you to dodge that. Squire Wall. They're just as skilled as we heard. Crossbow and sword. All the more reason we couldn't have arrived at a better time. That Rufus fellow is proving to be even more dangerous than I thought. What's the Grawl Sritter doing here? <laughs> no wonder the old gut was telling me things were gonna work out. Guess that makes me two for two today. Take your fellow evildoers and be gone, fallen dancer. Fallen dancer. <laughs> your schemes have met their end. So it seems. What a shame that we lost the element of surprise. How I hate letting Lloyd and Risha escape from my grasp, but oh well. What's gotten into you? You've got to be kidding me. Huh. Guess the party's over. <laughs> And I was just starting to enjoy myself. So too. many villains and evil. We'll have people. to settle for letting you have Kia. May we meet again soon, Yin and SSS. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> just leaping. He's pulling a wald from Azure. Just leaping. Oh, okay, cool. She transformed midair. Outfit. Yep. We'll cut things short for today. Couldn't Enjoy your freedom hair. while you can and have fun struggling against the inevitable. You're helpless to stop us now that you've lost your way. <gasps> What's that supposed to mean? <sighs> <laughs> the curtain has risen on the show of a lifetime and nothing can lower it now. So sit back and watch the fun unfold. The world will soon become one with Crossbell at its center, just as we've always wanted. Okay. Ilya, wait! Wait! It's not true, right? Tell me you weren't the one who enslaved the people of Crossbell. Tell me you weren't the one who turned poor Sansan against us. 
have to prove yourself worthy if you want to play a part in this great performance. Yeah, because that's a, like, what is no Ilya's No performer gets to take the stage this. without an audition now, do they? I'm looking forward to playing judge. Yeah, because everyone Ilya! else was like, oh, hey. Ilya! And it's like, oh, I'm doing this for X. I'm doing this for Y. And it's like, what is Ilya doing it for? Even if she's being, like, coerced into it. Hey, yo, last year is Act 2, and... That's what I like to see. Save. There we go. Okay, so Act 2, all taken care of. Okay, forces you into Act 3 for first. Okay, okay, with C. So, I say C, Rufus. Um, dude, RLR. <laughs> That's this game. RLR. Rufus, just put the, put the mask back on. I like it better when you have the mask on. Uh, Rufus, Ru and ooh. okay. So I'm probably gonna I'm gonna start this. See, uh, well, um, March 17th. See how it goes in terms of like structure. I'm hoping that they hoping they whips out a reverie mirror soon, but maybe not because nine volley. Yo, oh, it's the nine, nine volley has an airship? Okay. Was not expecting that. Yo, it's Michi. Yo, Jinko can just do this? She can pilot airships? It shouldn't surprise me. You were quite punctual. You bet. <laughs> yeah. Pay me a lot of money. Sup, and welcome aboard the Argo, the Argo. vessel of Nine Valley's new high speed transport service. <laughs> Our pilot is a child. We might have been better off on the ground. I'll have you know that I'm a licensed pilot. And that's real rich coming from you guys. Still don't exactly understand how people do, like, in these airships where they have, like, literally a steering wheel. <laughs> it's like, how do you how do, you do like, complex maneuvers? Because it's like, you don't got a thing that you can, like, push forward to go down, right? You look like a bunch of kids about to go on a picnic with their daddy to me. Ooh. We got burned. Shit. <laughs> but boy, did I not see your daddy's ID coming. Who knew my mystery client would turn out to be our former Governor General, Rufus Alborea? Oops. What, do you prefer Supreme Leader now? <laughs> Rufus Alborea, yeah, what, <laughs> what is going on here? Please, if I knew I'd be repeating myself so soon, I would have gathered my audience. That title is not mine. But then... I'm confused. Who's Rufus? Yeah, Lapis doesn't fucking know about the past. About That's the this guy's real name. C was a nickname. So it's Rufus, huh? Hmm. I think it's much cuter than C. I give it 85 points. Damn, okay. Ooh, he kicked your butt, S. Why would I care when I don't even get what criteria she's basing these on? So are you famous then, Rufus? Everyone seems to know who you are. More like infamous. He's not just famous. He's super famous. He's the elder son of House Alborea. One of the four great houses of Erebonia. And he became Crossbell's first governor general. Together with the Empire's Chancellor and Crown Prince, he led the country to all-out war. But then he got arrested after it ended. That's all the big common knowledge stuff. But trust me. I know all about the skeletons in his closet. Mm. Wow, you're so smart, Nadia. Is knowing part of handling the unpleasant side of things? Wow, you're so smart, Rufus. <laughs> Just this ass. You try not to stir up trouble with him. You're so smart. Yeah, well, he's apparently not done making a name for himself. Because three days ago, he busted himself out of jail so he could lead a he could lead a load of black-clad soldiers in the crossbow and occupy it again. Then he declared himself the new supreme leader and claimed he was carrying on the late Chancellor Osborne's will. You're saying that wasn't you? Yeah, hang on. You were in Crossbell yesterday and at noon today making statements. When'd you have time to go to Heimdall? He couldn't have been at this Crossbell like you said. He's been with us the entirety of today and yesterday. Then that means... So there are two Rufus Alborans? Or more like... One of you's a fraud. So it seems... I have no interest in making a public show of him being one, mind you. But I am the genuine Rufus Alborain. On that, you have my word. I guess I believe you. 
Even if Crossbow mistakes the other guy for the real deal, your brother'd be able to tell the difference. Yeah, because if you remember when we knocked him out in the fight, or vice versa, um, Rufus even, like, he had, like, an, a battle line saying, Wait, I recognize something like that, where I was like, wait, what? <laughs> Can't say I even care. I'm just in it for the mirror. Speaking of, I thought the Erebonian government seized all your assets. How are you gonna pay your fare? I've long kept my assets spread out in the event something like this were to happen. What the government seized is a mere fraction of what I own. <laughs> Rich people! <laughs> you really do prepare for anything, huh? Yeah, I was worried we were duped into doing charity work for a sec. Well, we've come this far. I think it's about time you start filling in the blanks. About what, exactly? You. I don't plan to call things off just because we know who you are now. But you've got to admit that you're not an average guy, and that means being around you is a huge risk on our part. I think you owe us a more thorough explanation of one on what we're up to before we met, or on what you were up to before we met, and what you're after now. It's the least you can do if we're keeping the, if we're going to keep working together. Very well. I'd intended to do as much from the very beginning anyway. Um, I should probably change my stream title to be Act Three, just in case anyone has not sufficiently gone through Act Two for the reveal. Yeah. Very well. I'd intended to do as much from the very beginning anyway. You'll have to understand the full scale of our situation before we advance to the next stage. Rufus's tone remained flat as he recounted recent events. It began late at night on March 14th when Oryx Fort in the Croatian province fell under attack. This was the work of the Ebon Defense Force, who were there to aid the crossbow division of the Imperial Defense Force in their escape. Upon freeing the idea from their underground cells, they continued on to another cell in that same fort, Rufus Alvarez. Yet their aim was not to free their former leader, but to assassinate him. Oh yeah. Rufus definitely turned the tables against them while also managing to extract a wealth of information, even if their knowledge lacked the finer details. He learned that they had abducted Prince Oliver and would be executing a major operation in less than 24 hours. Oh god. He also, learned of, of, he also learned of a small suitcase that the EDF wished to find with great urgency. So the EDF wanted Lapis, and the EDF were the ones that abducted them. So the other Rufus is the one that abducted Oliver and Charizard, but just not this Rufus. <laughs> Sending trouble brewing in the wake of Crossbow's liberation, Rufus then resolved to escape to better assess the situation at hand. The next day, March 15th, was no less eventful. An imposter using Rufus' name and face as his, as his own stormed Crossbow's signing ceremony and declared it occupied once more. This information, paired with intelligence gathered to suggest further trouble brewing in Heimdall, helped the real Rufus ascertain his objective. objective. He issued a statement claiming to be the Prince's abductor to lure Class 7 to the Imperial Capital. And following that, he set his sights on Oryx Canyon to take this enigmatic case the EDF were so desperately seeking. Yeah, Oryx Canyon. You know the rest, of course. Wow. You've been a busy boy, huh? Well, I'd been cooped up in a cell for half a year. I had plenty of pent-up energy eager to be spent. To continue, it's clear that the actions of the EDF and my spuria and a spurious self were planned to the letter. I imagine a multitude of events these past months have been part of their grand scheme, not just the recent attack on the city. The post-war occupation, and the occupiers electing to ignore my calls to surrender, and even the city's liberation a month ago. If this fake Rufus is pulling the strings here, you being around is only going to be one big headache for him. You think it's possible you being locked up in the same place as the IDF was intentional? I would assume so. Everything about it right down to my assassination attempt. And that in and itself was just a small part of something much greater. And what are you planning to do about it? You sound like you've got a pretty good idea of what you're up against. So what does the real Rufus want? I have two goals. The first is to eliminate the imposter who seeks to use my name for ill. Makes sense if it means them being around equals people trying to kill you. The second is to settle a past debt. Oh? Crossbow's current status traces its origins to the war that ended not long ago. I, the primary member of the Ironbloods, was one of two who led the charge in that war, the other being the very man whom I revered as a father, the late Chancellor. Having made this mess, it falls to me to clean it up. The Ironbloods are an awful loyal bunch. 
I also feel a certain degree of responsibility toward Crossbow as its former Governor General. Let me see if I got my head around this. In short, you want to rectify Crossbow's situation and fix whatever's going on in Erebonia. That sum it up right? That would be the end result, yes. That's a lot to expect four people to pull off. That's why I never specified it being us to achieve that end result. There's no reason it has to be us who faces our enemies. Confronting evil and overcoming it with heart and willpower is best suited to heroes, not villains like myself. <laughs> the legend of heroes! Mike Green and his friends, whom we fought earlier, and their SSS counterparts in the crossbow. No need to imitate what they have perfected. Works for me. It doesn't feel like our style. What we can do is learn the truth behind these myriad occurrences in our own way. And we can start with the very valuable clue we happen to have in our possession. Hmm? What is it? <laughs> Why are you staring at me? You're just so cute that we can't help ourselves. Really? I see. That makes perfect sense. To be admired is the destiny of a masterpiece. Gaze upon me to your heart's content. It's hard for me to picture a doll being the key to unraveling all that's going on. It's weird, yeah. And her not remembering anything makes it that much harder. Got any plans for tackling that one, boss? I just so happen to have a question for you two regarding that very issue. Uh, Jorg Rosenberg, George, or Jorg, Jorg, I'm gonna keep on Jorg. Jorg Rosenberg was her manufacturer and the man who requested that she be delivered to me? Well, technically, yeah. Now that our work in Heimdall is done, I was hoping to visit him in person. But your hesitant response tells me that may not be possible. There's something befallen him. No, nope, he's fine. It's just not much, uh, it's, it's just not much would be gained by going to see him. He's the one who gave us the job, but he specified that he was just an intermediary. My guess is that whoever had him give us the job else is the one who got him to make it. Mainly because he didn't seem to know much more than we do right now. I see. Then our only choice is to aid her in recovering her memories after all. I assume you don't know where you were originally crafted. I wish I did, but I'm afraid not. Got a place we can start, at least. Jörg didn't directly deliver the case to us. He said to pick it up from the Moon Temple. He must have hidden it there before hightailing it out of Crossbell. It'd be safe to bet to say she was made there or close to there. Almost certainly the Rosenberg studio on the Mains Mountain Path, then. Sounds about right. We passed on the way down, uh, way to the temple, but didn't go inside. A wise decision. If the Meister hid the case elsewhere, then the studio has been compromised in some manner, I'm sure. We still do not know if a memory loss was un unintended or deliberate. But danger or no, it's possible that we'll find something to ease her current predicament. So we know where we're going, then. Of course, was our, uh, our course was always going to lead to Crossbow. The timing is apt. We may as well go now. Okay, yep. So... This is where C and Lloyd are going to over-intersect, which is cool. How are we going to get in when the borders are so well protected? Fear not. I have a, I have a plan. No, it will require some preparation. I'll need your participation in order for it to work, but the details can wait. For now, rest well, children. Rest well, child. Rufus, Act 3. Light in the dark. I was getting so sleepy while they talked, but I feel wide awake now. Perhaps I'll tour the ship and see what everyone is up to. Aw, oh, that's adorable. Okay, so, yeah. Oh yeah, I also got uh, more books from the Reverie as well. Miscellaneous Ilya. Lego, Ilya Taxi. Interesting that she is this version, not the blonde version. Find that, find that interesting. Mateus. Crossbell. Uh, Cecily. Thor's. Okay, you're already. Boys love prevails. There you go, Spell. There you go. Remember, Ash's feedback on the third volume of a romance series to which he replies, oh, hell no. Rufus. Yeah. Reborn ILF. I wish it still said C. Man, I want to, I want to put his mask back on so bad. New and old. Special support section. Yo, Zeit! I saw boy Zeit! Love it. Um, okay, can I? Like, is that a thing I can do? Costume? Simple. Oh god, the fact that he's only in... 
It's this is weird. A revealing swimsuit for sea to wear. Yeah, okay. Cancel. Um, and let me put, let me put his mask back on. Okay. Well, I mean, I guess. Yeah, I guess I can do that. Because now it doesn't matter. Uh, four mint quartz. You guys are doing well on that. Okay. Hey, Lapis. Is she asleep? Sure is. That's a shame. I wanted to play with her. Sorry to disappoint, but let her rest, okay? She always wants to sleep, so today's been a long, rough one for her. Does she normally sleep a lot? That's an understatement. She spends most of our days out on days out like a light. Her our off days out like a light. She can even fall asleep in the middle of combat. Has she ever been to a doctor to fix it? Oh no. She's not sick, just very laid back. Um, and the canonical reason for it is basically she's making up for sleep that she was not able to get over the course of like multiple years. Um, right? Like she would only sleep for like an hour a day um, for over the course of like three years. And it is only when she is nearby Swin that she's actually able to sweet sleep in a restful way for longer than that. Um, so she's essentially getting back the sleep that she did not get before. Things they have a real pain sometimes, though, let me tell you. I'm sure it does. She's my partner. There's no one else I'd rather depend on when it counts. Besides, I swear to protect her in her brother's place. I intend to honor that for the rest of my life. Are you and her brother different or the same? I'm finding it hard to wrap my mind around the idea of siblings. Hmm. Let me put it like this. How would you feel if your Grosenberg were to make another doll exactly like you? If they were exactly like me, then they would be perfect. The world being blessed with more perfect things to admire is a good thing. Well, what if that other doll wasn't as cute, pretty, strong, or emotive as you are? What if others called them a failure? Hmm, there isn't any such thing as a Rosenberg that's also a failure. But if by some chance that were to happen, I'd be very annoyed to hear others speaking of them that way. There you go, then. That's how siblings are. You think Rufus would be annoyed if he heard something like that about his brother? That's who that boy we saw before is, right? Beats me. I don't know the first thing about what goes on in that guy's head. So it's a mystery? Yeah. Anyway, you should try and get some rest while we have the chance. Assuming dolls need rest, anyway. Okay, thank you, Swin. <laughs> What's up? Are you be asleep by now? I'm not tired yet. Say, why don't you give me a neat bedtime story? Like what? You're uh, kind of me putting on, you're kind of putting me on the spot. Okay, then why don't you tell me about your swords then? You're neat enough. I like the way you can take them apart and put them back together. Yeah, got a pretty unique mechanic to them. When they're apart. I mark my targets to hit them dead on, uh, dead on without a problem. Then I put them together so I can really lay into them for a ton of damage. They're more like special ornaments than weapons if you want to be nitpicky. Though. Hmm, sounds like a little too complicated for me, but you sure look amazing when you use them. See, now, should I take it slow until you live in or should I give you a delectable dollop of poison to make it nice and quick? <laughs> it's easy. How do you stream? Sure are. Careful. Hmm. Yeah, so they even describe it in 3 and 9 where it's like... I wonder what it's uh, like to have a sibling. Do I have any out there? Uh, where basically his swords, like the marking and blowing them up. Oh yeah, so I should wear it. walk around and Um, they're like, they cause an orbital explosion. Right, so they are more ornament than weapon. Well, well, if it isn't my littlest customer, you want something? I just felt the urge to tour the ship, and you're hardly big. Nah, <laughs> I'm still bigger than you. And come to think of it, I haven't introduced myself to you yet now, have I? The name's Jingo. If there's anything you want your hands on, you can just give me a holler. I'm Lapis. Nice to meet you, Lapis. By the way, you're not human, right? Indeed, I am not. I'm a proud Rosenberg doll. <laughs> really? <laughs> the world's full of surprises. You don't look surprised to me. When you're in my line of work, you meet all kinds of folks. You're not the first unusual customer I've had. I'm not? Your job sounds very interesting. You know what else would be interesting? Mods. Could I interest you in your Gatling gun for an arm, or eyes that will let you shoot lasers out of them? I'll give you a pretty discount. You can do all of that? It'd be worth a shot. 
Hmm. I agree that would be interesting, but none of it sounds as beautiful as my current design, so I'll kindly pass. No big. You change your mind. You know where I am. I certainly do. Anyway, it's about time for Cerberus' lessons. Cerberus! Woof. What's his lesson about? Being the strongest god dog around. Well, now I've got to know. What does that take? So far I've had him help with the cleaning and run my shop, but today he's getting pointers on flying this baby. He's got to be able to navigate anything life throws at him. That includes a steering wheel. <laughs> woof woof. Okay then. First, I need you to plop yourself on top of my seat. Wait, is this gonna work? I guess as long as your front paws can reach the wheel, it's all good. You can do this, Cerberus. Good boy. Woof woof. My god. Hang on a minute. <laughs> I, I wasn't gonna butt in at first, but I can't keep my mouth shut after what I just heard. Oh yeah? What's that? Uh, maybe the whole idea of trying to teach a dog to fly this airship? Still not hearing what the problem is. How's he supposed to learn if he doesn't take the wheel? All of that is a problem. You're trying to make a dog transcend the limits of the canine species. Come on, now you're just exaggerating. But you're welcome to tune in on his lesson if you want. What part of what I said makes you think... I just had a dream where the whole airship fell out of the sky. Where are you, S? Comfort me. Anyway, we're paying for this flight, so if you want to attempt the impossible, do it on your own time. We'd like to live for the landing, if we please. Woof. Ah, fine. You're one tough customer. <sighs> <laughs> Cerberus is so cute! I hope I can pet him later on. I really do enjoy the fact that Lapis being literally a new person right she has no experience at like she has no common knowledge she has no common sense other than i am perfect and there and and i am cute and those are good so it's so fun to see her just be like oh yeah no carry on teaching a dog to fly a ship that makes sense to me I think your axe is cool too by the way oh no you swing the hulking thing around like it's light as a feather what kind of crazy technology does Rosenberg put in his dolls? Promise us that we'll always be together. It's easy. Oh, that's sweet. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, I should probably also oop, save. Uh, there we go. Okay. Interesting. So, yeah, I literally can't go. Uh, into the Reverie Corridor right now. I'm afraid this side of the deck is occupied. You'll have to sleep elsewhere. Oh, you're sleeping out here? Yo, you pulling a Joshua from second chapter? I wasn't planning to sleep out here. Oh? Then what's brought you outside? I am wandering. I wanted to go stargazing. What about you? I wanted to take in the night air. Since we're both here, there's something I'd like to ask. What is it? I know that you're a famous man, but are you a good man or a bad man? <laughs> bad, though that would be putting it mildly. Mm, yeah, <laughs> because I remember what you did to frickin' Aryan Road, you son of a bitch. So very bad? Very, very bad. <laughs> I have used anything and everything to advance my interests. Be it titles, fame, or even those pure of heart. There is little point in feigning a moral compass when human lives hold no value to me. Or acting chivalrous when all that does is hinder me. Do you still feel that way? I do. I'm using you, Swin and Nadia, to bring my designs to fruition, am I not? I'm also using those we met in the capital, like my brother. None of that sounds like something someone good would do, yes. You really are a very bad man. I'm glad we could come to an understanding. <laughs> you are bad. So, armed with that knowledge, what do you intend to do? Am I supposed to do something? <laughs> is there something bad about associating with a bad man? I suppose a doll has no reason to care if a human is good or evil. Being a doll has nothing to do with it. But were you hoping I would admonish you? Or perhaps comfort you? 
Of course not. Okay. Then I still intend to do nothing. Whether I praise you for your deeds as a hero, or chastise you for your misdeeds as a villain, it won't change you at your core. You are who you are. Just how does humanity look through your lens for you to think in such simple terms? I don't know. I can't answer that when I'm still learning about what it means to be human. Hmm. All I can say is, I don't see if you're good or bad, where you're from, or how you were raised. I don't see what you've done or haven't done, what you possess or what you lack. Because none of those are what make you exist as a person. So it can't be that you suddenly don't exist just because someone decides to reject those parts of you. That's a... Uh... Quite a philosophical approach to the matter. Or perhaps that objective thinking is the most one of artificial intelligence can fathom. I don't know. How could I know? Just to me, being is what makes a human a human. Perhaps you're right. And so, it's what makes you, you. <sighs> perhaps you're right. I... Yeah, because that might I be... I don't remember the exact moment I began to search for meaning in my life. Yeah, because like, that might be like literally the first moment in life where like someone has just wholeheartedly been like, oh yeah, you're, you are you, Rufus. We're like, not you are a villain, you are a hero, you are an Albarea, you are uh, like... And iron blood you are the like leader of the noble alliance right like it's not necessary like that might be the first time someone's just like you are your own person like that that very well could have been the first time where he's not put on a pedestal for some reason and he's just like oh no you're i'm i'm looking at you only as you because that's all i can see you as no, because for someone like Lapis, where titles mean nothing, history means nothing, because she doesn't remember anything he's done, it's only how he's acted to her that has any guiding principle on how she would view him, right? That it's like, oh yeah, her experience with him would be one of very pure standing. Right, where she's just kind of able to take in information and be like, "Oh yeah, like I I can a attribute that to you, but it me it the extended par part of it means nothing to me." Right, you say you're bad, you say you're evil. That doesn't mean anything to her, be because so what? It like you say it, but that you have yet to make me her lapis sad, or do anything negative to her. It's just, oh yeah, you, you you are basically adding things to your character profile for Lapis, but it doesn't translate to any meaningful change in how she would act towards you. My father elected to raise me as his own son, irrespective of the fact I was born because his wife laid with another man. <laughs> yes. He did so with the Baller. same ease he rejected his flesh and blood because he was born from a common woman. Hmm. Yeah. When I learned the truth, I finally understood that House Alberea wanted me not as a human being, but as a product of noble blood. It was so hard to bear that it made me sick. Was that all? Was that the only reason I existed? Hmm. Noble blood? I refused to accept it. Couldn't take it. And as I turned my eyes from this terrible truth, a new, more terrible thought dawned upon me. If that was not the reason I existed, then what was? And this is the thing, where it's like searching for the reason for existence when, realistically, right, like, we can each deem our own goal, right? This is why I exist. This is, like, what I want to do with my life, right? But the long and short of it is, right, at the end of the day, it's we exist not for a reason, but because of others' actions, right? 
the reason we exist is to I don't know exist right we like every single person currently alive was effectively willed to life by their parents <laughs> not for any specific reason other than hey I want you to be born or I want the child to be born right not necessarily like any other reason like it is <laughs> giving birth is at the same uh, mutual uh, coincidingly one of the most selfish and selfless things that you can do right because you are giving someone the gift of life pretty selfish but you are burdening them with the fact that they have to live <laughs> right like and that is arguably a selfish thing, because if you are not in, let's say, a blessed situation, then you are effectively forcing another life to be beholden to that fate. Um, but there's no reason behind continued existence. There's just a reason as to why you existed in the first place. And that reason is your parents banged. <laughs> is effectively it um but searching for a goal in life is not the reason why you exist it's what you want to do with the life that you were given if there is anything even close to a gu guiding principle towards hey why do we live it's because it's to die <laughs> right the reason why we live is to live our life and then die at the end death is the is the is the universal equalizer it is the end quote unquote goal of every person it's more just how do you want to get to that end point and most people would agree it's i want to get there after many many years of happiness sadness life and then die peacefully painlessly uh and getting there is the is the difficult part that was when i met him but when you try and think of it in like the metaphysical terms like oh we all must exist for a reason it's like well why though and that and that's where you start kind of driving yourself crazy and start applying like you start for like trying to enforce ideals onto other people potentially because it's like if you so hardly believe all people were born for a reason to like achieve something well then that means you think others doing it and then if others aren't acting in a way that you think would reflect that view set then you start you would start trying to apply it being like hey why aren't you acting like like it matters why aren't you trying to achieve xyz like that's your that's a person's reason for existence it's like no no it isn't and that's what you think people's <laughs> reason for existence is but a lot of a lot of cultures don't really even have like a, the an idea of like like what is your life's reason it's just oh no we exist with nature <laughs> right like what is a deer's reason for existence it's to be born live as a deer and die as a deer <laughs> that's it so what is a human's reason for existence to be born as a human live as a human and die like a human it's, it's pretty simple but complex it is said we seek that which we do not have. Through him, I sought the father I never had. Mm. I convinced myself that if I did as sons do and became more than he ever was, then I would understand the real reason for my existence. And there it was. At last, I had a goal, something to pursue. Mm. And that's it. That's it. Right. Reason to live versus goal people do false equivalents hey they're one and the same but the goal is intrinsically personal whereas a reason to live is almost like it's it's mm, like you can associate your own personal reason for it but it's not like give it to you i stopped at nothing to make that goal a reality there was no effort too ambitious, no principle too sacred to violate. I'd rather use the right version of principle. 
But no matter what I did, it still wasn't enough. Everything I had done to secure my victory had led to a resounding, humiliating defeat. A defeat at the hands of my own brother, who despite his unfortunate upbringing, had grown into someone strong and true. I envied him for that. Yeah, and th those are the like the four people most associated with. It's like, hey, there's Reen, Milliam, and Machius. <laughs> but perhaps I should have known all along that a mere product could never hope to have a real, genuine purpose. The whole predicament would have been worth a laugh had it not been so deeply painful. Why am I here? What is my reason for being? Who am I? You are who you are. Hmm. I don't see what you've done or haven't done, what you possess or what you lack, because none of those are what make you exist as a person. Just to me, being is what makes a human a human. <laughs> Such nonsense. Okay, so she does. Oh yeah, because I mean, she was. I thought you weren't place. planning to sleep out here. I'm unsure if dolls are capable of catching coals, but I believe you've taken in the stars enough for one night. Okay. I like this, and like I feel like this is a very necessary immediate following last chapter, right? Because like you don't know the sea is Rufus, so that means. As soon as it's revealed that he is, you need to immediately jump into, okay, where is his mindset? What is his character doing right now as a character, like mentally? Because it's like, okay, CS4, that's fresh. The shit he was doing in CS4, that's pretty fresh. It's like, okay, being a real villain. And he did like the stand thing where it's like, okay, I'll take the, I'll take the fall. But it's still like, okay, like what's going on here? <laughs> Are you all prepared? Ready to go anytime. We're good at this stuff. I don't know what we're preparing for, but I'll give it my best. I think this will be best served if you say nothing at all. Hmm. Okay then, I'm gonna make a landing. Crossbell Airport. Rufus Best Boy? Uh, I will hold my take on it until we get to the end of the game. I want, I need to see where his character goes before I, before I update my opinion on it. Sorry to like him after that. Oh yeah, no, I mean, like it definitely makes more sense. It doesn't, it doesn't seem like, yeah, it, like, as I said, the best part about characters and especially characters and trails, right? It's characters are characters. They are flawed. They have strong points. They have weak points. And the weak points are highlighted for character growth going forward, right? Seeing Rufus in CS1 through 4, you see all of his downsides. You see him doing villainy shit. And you see it kind of coming to a head in CS4 where he is the most emotive, right? He is the most emotional. Because that's when things are not going according to plan or they are be they are effectively unraveling very quickly because class 7 and what they're doing um so there's a lot of like negatives to really play off of here to show him grow and become a better person it's not my fault and see like go backwards find out more about him his viewpoint on it and uh go and see like okay why did he do all the things he did because before it was like okay they revealed that you know he kind of saw osborne as a father figure he tested him using the jaegers and then he was like okay i'll be an iron blood you're you're cool but it seemed more of like a you know surrogate father bond or even just like a reverence toward met like high levels of competency beyond normal scope that's like i want to be with that um but now we're seeing more it's like oh there's a lot of self-doubt going on with and 
you know, surrounding just his entire upbringing and childhood and why he wanted to even go forward with it. Why do it simple, curse. In fact, I would argue Rufus is one of the few people that wasn't under the effect of the curse in, in CS4, right? Like, out of everyone there, he probably was the least cursed up for, like, the stuff he was doing. Like, the Iron Bloods, frankly, weren't really cursed up. They used, like, the power of the curse in their fights, those final fights, to, like, access the strength. But, like, in terms of being forced into doing things, the Iron Bloods were probably the least cursed because they were just so loyal to Osborne and were willing to just do it without needing their... Needing it, like, me never liked the curse. Oh, yeah, no. It, 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 it's... It, it's too much of, like, a plot contrivance a lot of the time, I feel like, for why certain characters did certain things. Um, I wish they had, like, pulled back a bit on it. Um, like, in ter at least in terms of, like, saying what is happening so often. Um, like, I don't have an issue with the curse existing as, like, like a general idea towards Erebonia's more militariness, more belligerent nature. Right, it's just like a, almost like an ever-present, like, like, push towards the fight response of fight or flight, right? Always trying to be belligerent and aggressive, and that kind of pushes it. But the moment when it's like, oh, hey, I'm going to be able to, like, take, like, really push you towards negative things just out of nowhere, right? It, th that's when I start going, like, eh, it's... It's a bit much. Like, I get it. Like, it would be hard to build towards what CS4 was doing without the curse. But even still, it's not, like... I think it's one of the weaker points because it's, like, gives you such a free out. It's like, oh, like, they're under the effects of the curse. Whatever. They're, like, eh. Oh, it's the curse. It's the curse. Like, it's not good when you just say, it's the curse. <laughs> right? Uh, halt, are you authorized to be here? <sighs> oh, gonna- Oh, hey, you can put on extensions. Y Your Excellency! What's the meaning of this? You stand in the presence of our Supreme Leader. We informed you in advance of our arrival. Why are we not ready and waiting? Uh, our deepest apologies! At least Rufus can take responsibility for his life. Exactly, yeah, and he, and he seemed intent on doing it. He stayed in prison. And then when he was about to be assassinated at the hands of people trying to make things worse, he's like, okay, I'm going to get out of here to go fix shit, right? He's not out because he wants to enjoy freedom. He's out because he he wants to make good on effectively what he was trying to do by going to prison. Um, I have a feeling that, it, like, it, it will really depend. I'm willing to bet that by the end of the game stuff happens and it's like oh your prison sentence is whatever canceled because you helped save the world or whatever but i'm more willing to bet or i would be willing to bet that rufus is like okay i just saved everything cool put me back in prison <laughs> like he'll go walk to his cell himself because that that's what this rufus is striking me as someone who really wants to make amends for all the bad stuff they did but this is just one part of it. Our deepest apologies. There's no need to be quite so harsh. These are good men. This airport has only been under their jurisdiction for a few days. It takes time to adjust to new responsibilities. You're merciful, Your Excellency. We'll be ready. We'll ready a car for you at once. No need. I've arranged for one personally. So remain here and continue your duties. Yes, Your Excellency. Walk with that swagger through enemy forces. A bizarre experience. Not everyone gets to be their own imposter. It's hilarious. Good on you for thinking it up, boss. Well, I wasn't lying about them being good. It won't be long before they learn the truth from their superiors and come after us. We shouldn't remain in the city any longer than is needed. Can't hurt to scope out the place first, though, right? I suppose. We'll have to make a brief tour before continuing on for the main mountain path. Does part of scoping out mean inspecting all the restaurants? That's gonna have to wait till next time. 
I refuse. I refuse to call mains anything but mains, even though they call it mines in <laughs> in the game. It's mines mountain path, but it's mines the mining village, and I absolutely hate that it is called mines. <laughs> so I'm gonna keep calling it mains. All right, I forgot. I got this stuff from Jingo. What is it? A farewell gift, apparently. Custom rod and custom spooler. Yo, these guys can fish now. Nice. What? Did you think we're off on a picnic or something? What's a picnic? <laughs> you are too darn cute, LP. No point in looking a gift horse in the mouth. Let's use it. We'll look for tor we'll look like tourists or something. Good for camo. Indeed. I'll leave it to, use to your discretion. Just try not to stand out too much. Got it. Might be nice to take a breather every now and again. Swin and Nadia can now- Okay, only those two, though. Rufus is now in stealth mode. Rufus will move by the scene. Stealth mode due to ram dysfunctionality. Now, a note that when Rufus is the party leader in town, he cannot be seen by others or use shops. Rufus with mask, Rufus in shirt. Yo, okay. Excuse me. Just gonna put that mask back on. Rufus in shirt. Simply see. Simply see. Hey, you like a dude in a speedo? Oh, look at that ass. <laughs> but no, Rufus with mask. Because him with mask just looks better. I like him with I like him with mask. You know, you don't see passenger trains run through here anymore. There's a time when you see all kinds of trains coming again. Hope those days aren't gone for good. Yeah, there's the train fanatic. Yum. Going down to Geo Front. Blah da blah da doo. Geo Front entrance is locked. Oh, okay. Um, I was really hoping they would pull out their mirror soon, but I guess like they're not really on friendly so terms with everyone else yet. Search? So. The administrative district. Could be flying a little too close to the sun, but then again, sometimes that's what you gotta do to nab something juicy. Very astute. Indeed, the higher the risk, the greater the reward. Generally. I don't see why we shouldn't go there at some point, personally. Okay, he's new Ron's armor. Do you even have a weapon reaper? Got by Gold Fighter, Flake, okay. Metal boots. Um, I could increase your defense, but not a big deal. Honestly, I feel like the biggest thing is right, they, not everyone has like quips. Yeah, most people do. Oh wait, if the bear, hmm, I have to wonder. Cause the, yeah, I think it's every time you do a new game plus the, the DLC reprocs. So, um. I just go in here. Uh, doors locked. Huh? This is so. If I do DLC, so I should be able to get another bear and bear. Um, the seventh in New Game Plus, which would be fun. Uh, huh? This is precisely. And seeing as it appears to be vacant, we best be on our way. Yo, are we gonna get to use Ramda units in uh in Calvert? Can can we go stealth mode in Calvert when we play Koro? Amy. Meow, meow. Oh, you worried about me? It's okay, Daddy's at work, and Mommy's a Michelin, so she can't come home yet. I know it's scary since the sea's acting all weird, but we gotta keep, keep, keep tough, though. Be as tough as can be. Because this isn't sad just because things are scary, right? So we can't get sad either. Let's keep smiling, cop. Meow. You're a good cat, cop. We've been sip at the cafe. Okay. So this is probably just like scope out or go, at least go to the administrative edition first. Pruna and Lemley. Pruna. I'm Pruna. Hello, Cynthia. What are Pearl's doing all right on Marco? Jeanette has been acting kind of strange. Materia was supposed to do, uh, be due back. So it was to be was supposed to be due back soon and everything. Just how long we have to put up with this. Bye. I'm not sure with Becky. Dude, now that I think about it, because not everyone comes, like, I don't think you'll be able to go back to certain places. I'm almost kind of worried. 10,000 Mishy Tail. Strength 100, actually, but 100. Delay plus 3. Um, I'm actually kind of worried about being able to, um, come back and actually buy these peckies. I... Unless it's like, oh, at the end of the game, once you've, like, done everything, then you can revisit places, maybe? I don't know. But 
this game isn't structured like CS2 or 4, so I can't really take a take a crack at even guessing. Please petrify invasion plus six. Um Yeah, you know what? I'll put you as my my resident delayman here, because you're mostly you're the mostly physical hitter, so that's good. So you know I can I don't even have that. Um Crit is already kind of guaranteed, so you know what? I'll put that on for more strength. Yeah, I don't have any evade. Couldn't make some. I wing Okay. Let's go to Gen 10. And music is so good. By Miss Schneider Watch. Yeah. Chuckle. Talk. Hi, welcome to. Oh, it's not if we have kids your age coming on by themselves, just between you and me. If you're a good kids, I think you should stay home where it's safe right now. I don't know what the deal is with that Rufus guy's speeches. They keep playing on the monitor cars down around town. They seem to be brainwashing people into following his every word. Be careful. Anyway, if you kids get into any trouble, I'll try to help you the best I can. I know some good people, and I'm sure we can find a way to help you, even if we have to keep it on the down low. Why, how generous, but keep that in mind. She's friendly with me. Well, kind of angry if she knows people who are working underground. Hmm. Five quarts. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I should probably do some more slot ups. So. Let's get everyone a second slot maxed. I think that's. Wait, did I not? Wait, what the hell? There we go. Second slot maxed. That way, at least working towards, working towards it from some direction. Because I don't want to just keep sitting there with nothing going. Nothing moving forward. Keep moving forward, as it were. Um, okay. You know what I'm gonna do? You know what I'm gonna do? This is where I am going to call it a night because I've been going for almost five hours at this point. So, uh, I want to call it there. This was a good, this was a good time. Went, th made a lot of progress today. A lot of interesting developments. Um, I'm very much excited to continue going now that we know that C is Rufus, uh, or Rufus is C, I guess. Um, it'll be interesting to see how the plot develops based on who knows Rufus and who doesn't. Um, yeah, so thank you everyone for dropping by. Neko Dave, Sleeper, Fontano, much appreciated. Anyone who uh, lurked, also much appreciated. I will be streaming tomorrow at some point, so I hope you all have a very nice night, and will join me then. Bye. <laughs>